The Jane Daniels Experience Season 2 is about to begin right now, but if you guys want to unlock Season 3, please help me renew this by killing the like button. 5,000 likes will renew a Season 3. To recap last season, we lost the Seahawks in the playoffs. I made some horrible decisions, but part of it was because our O-line was horrible. But I want to talk about the good thing. Luke McCaffrey won Offensive Player of the Year. He's now a superstar dev. Jeremy Chin had 16 interceptions. He's now a superstar dev. We got the best D-line in the league. We have a ton of money. We got draft picks. I'm going all in. Jaden deserves a ring. I got some older players I might trade. I don't know what's going to happen in this season, but I can promise you I'm going to relax with Jaden Daniels. We're going to play MVP football with him, and we are going to get him his ring. So kill the like button, enjoy the video, and let's go. I hop out the car, leave the motor running. Why you always talking like you know something? Why you always talking, go and show him something? No stunt double, I do my own stunt. Could take a year, I'll still have that paper coming. Put like 10 on the 90, I keep it so on it. All in the club, we don't do no clubbing. Throw like 10 on the 90, I keep it so on it. Orange label, I might pop me too. I was getting money, but they didn't have a clue. Ladies and gentlemen, Commander's franchise is doing. Please, can you do me a favor? Look on the screen now, Jaden Daniels. Can we please make this multiple seasons? I want to see this guy's entire career play out. So, kill the like button. 6,000 likes will unlock in their episode. So, make sure if you're watching right now and you want another Commander's franchise, kill the like button. Guys, we got lots to discuss. Last season, as I kind of mentioned, um, I choked a little bit in the playoffs. We got a big draft coming up. Jaden Daniels had a crazy season. We'll kind of briefly talk about his season. 39 touchdowns to 15 picks. Far from perfect, but not bad. God abilities, obviously, um, did his thing. Other kind of key players that I want to talk about kind of in this intro, Luke McCaffrey had the best season of anybody. Um, he had 1,600 yards and 16 touchdowns. He was a real standout in year number one. He goes up to a superstar. So now we have two superstar receivers going into year two. Defensive wise, and like I said, this is just a quick recap. Boom, Jeremy Chin broke the NFL record for most interceptions in a season with 16 picks. Probably my best season ever with my user. He's now a superstar. That's pretty much it in terms of team development from year number one. Those were my guys. Now, I have a lot I wanna discuss going into this. The positions, I can show you guys the draft quick. Um, we have the correct draft class now. Will Johnson, as you can see, Judkins, Travis Hunter, Will Campbell. There's a ton of studs in this draft class. Um, obviously, you guys know this draft is pretty crazy. So we'll get into kind of the thick of that. But first thing I want to do is I want to talk about these players ready to negotiate. Because this is always like a natural starting point for a second season. Noah Brown, um, he wants $6 million to stay. I don't hate it, but I think I want to get younger with my third receiver, so I think I'm going to let him walk. Derek Forrest went up to Stardev last year. He's someone I really want to keep. So I'm actually going to slightly overpay because I think he's worth it and bring him back. He had a good enough year to go up to start. Farrell can go. Dyn Dynamy Brown can go. Noah, honestly, I'm not sad if he leaves, but he's still so young. Like, that's the thing. Like, He's still so young. Yes, he hasn't quite panned out as a crazy corner, but like for $3 million, he's still not interested in signing. Okay, kick rocks, man. Uh, Michael Davis is six foot two. He had a good year for us last year, a really good year for us. He also is leaving. Like if I lose Noah and Michael Davis, I'm in trouble. So now I feel like I gotta try and overpay at least a little bit for Michael. Yeah. Okay, Michael Davis stays with us, which is awesome. Um, Dante Fowler, Trent Scott, Tressway. I always make sure I go here. I think I can lose Austin Cyber. Tressway, I think I'd like to bring back. But yeah, those are going to be kind of my main player signings. A lot of guys are going to go. We're going to have $94 million in cap space. Now, talking about our team needs. Last year, what I felt like was our biggest issue... Um, was up here. I felt like our line was really bad. And I'm not even just saying that. Like I was running for my life a lot of this season and I made some horrible decisions running for my life, but this this line is not sustainable. It really is not. The line needs to get better. Ben Sinat starting year number two. We got a good tight end. Our receivers are pretty solid, but we got to figure that out in the draft. Our D line's really talented, really talented. Secondary, 
not bad. Like there, uh, you could argue we could draft any position. I I do need kind of like a true defensive end because Jamin Davis is 26. I just paid him 10 million dollars a year, but like I do think I probably could find better than Jamin Davis. It's hard to say, but I I don't think it would be impossible to kind of replace him. So we'll get into the thick of that um, now that we can look at the draft class. So this is the next obvious step. We're gonna do trade talks. We're gonna get on the phone. We're gonna be doing a bunch of stuff. This is our draft class. So as you guys can see, quarterbacks, Beck, Ewers, receivers, you got Luther Burden, Travis Hunter, Tatarioa McMillan, Amike Agbuka, Isaiah Bond, Antoine Wells, Evan Stewart, Tez Johnson, Xavier Restrepo, tight end. This is the part of the, that I wanna look at. Um, these guys. Now, the top dogs on the line are obviously going to be Will Campbell, Tate Rutledge, Calvin Banks, and Emory Jones. I would say those are the three best linemen. Where we're at, I don't necessarily feel like we get any of them, which is a slight worry for me. And I'll kind of dive into that a little bit more as we go. Really good D-line draft. Like, I don't think there's any situation where I would take D-line in the first round because it's so loaded. Like, it is just absolutely stacked. Like, you can get Abdul Carter probably in the second round. So it's like, James Pierce Jr. is someone who I would love, obviously. Like, he would be unbelievable, and I'd love to get him at some point, but he's just, he's probably going to be a top three pick. It's defensive line stacked. You got the Michigan guys, you got the Notre Dame guys. Like, there's a lot to this draft. You got Harold Perkins. And then DB-wise, you got Denzel Burke, Will Johnson, Ben Morrison out of Notre Dame, who I had in Notre Dame franchise, and Jabbar Muhammad. I could argue that we really need a DB. I definitely could look at this team, and it wouldn't be difficult for me to make an argument that that should be the position. Shiloh Sanders, Winston Jr., all of the above. This is kind of what we're looking at. I wanted to show you guys that before we got into free agency, before we got too deep into things. Um, and yeah, well, we'll get on some trade talks. Let's go to free agency. Obviously, I'm gonna be trying to move and groove and see what we can do. Guys, free agency. We got a kind of a small bag here. Um, I have 94 million in free agency money to spend. Um, and a lot of good players that I kind of briefly looked here and there's some there's some studs and people that would help us. Now, Zach Martin, he wants to play for us, but he's star development. Like he's not a superstar anymore. He's 34 years old, not a superstar in $21 million a year. So he's not getting any interest. The person who's getting all the interest is this Creed Humphrey, superstar. And with nine offers, he's going to cost me about $100 billion. I would say Creed Humphrey's out of. Trey Smith is possible. Like, there's a lot of good guards here. There's a lot of good guards that would help out our team. Trey Smith being one of them. I also could just, like, I feel like even for one year, my biggest need is definitely not receiver. It's not anything. It is line. I feel like Zach Martin, even though he, like he only wants a one year deal. Like to me, this is an intriguing free agent. Even though he's a star development guy, I feel like he makes my team 10 times better. And he'll obviously get bids by the end of this, but I feel like $24 million for the best guard in football, even though he doesn't have abilities anymore, is not horrible. Rather than overspending on a superstar Creed Humphrey, there's very few superstars even in this. Nick Bolton's another one, but he's got a ton of bids. That's kind of where I'm at with this free agency. The tackle market is pretty good as well. Um, I always like Jedrick Willis. Brown's an interesting one, uh, but he's 32 years old and he's known for not being like, I, I feel like I'd like to get that position elsewhere, but I'm very much interested in Nelson. Very, very, very much so. Uh, continuing with this. I wouldn't mind a quicker running back now that my initial running back's gone, but there just really isn't anyone who's super jumping out at me. Um, in terms of like lateral quickness, Michael Carter's there, Clyde Edwards, Elair. Um, receiver, I wouldn't sign. I don't think I would pay $20 million for any of these guys just because these are, this is kind of the, I don't want to say like, these are unbelievable players that are just a little bit older. They're very, very, very good, but he's not going to get any relevant abilities. So it's, it's difficult to justify spending 
on these guys. I honestly feel like the thing that I could do best is spend kind of where I'm looking right now and go for a very good guard. Christian Fulton I really like too. Dory Jackson's here. Like I don't, I think my depth is a little thin at DB. I have $70 million to spend. At the end of the day, we're not broke. I don't know why I'm acting like I'm broke. I'm really not broke. Who's got, who wants to play for us the most? I like players who want to play for me. Dory, like, would you guys hate me completely? If I, I feel like we're at that stage, I want one year rental. The reason I would sign someone like a Dory Jackson, let me take you to my depth chart right now. And it's gonna, it's not gonna look like a depth chart, it's gonna look like a lack of depth chart. When you look at my DB core, like, St. Just, Forbes, Davis, you know what? We actually have a good amount of depth. Never mind. I totally forgot about Mike Sandstrow. Never mind. I I don't feel like I need a Dory Jackson. You know what? Swerve. Let's swerve that. I'm gonna swerve that and I'm gonna cancel that bid. I've grown. Goodbye, Dory Jackson. I'm gonna withdraw that offer. Um, do I try and go for two guards? Or do I think about the future and just try and save a little bit of money here? I could get I could pay a bag to star to have Chase Young. Bring Chase back. Chase has kind of fallen off a little bit in the game. I could pay a billion dollars to bring him back. Is that the move? I don't know. Or I could go to the Broken Dream safety crew over here. I've made up my mind. Ben St. Just is Canadian and so is Dean Leonard. And Dean Leonard is like maybe the most underrated DB. So I'm going to save my money for a future year. Um, not that I don't want to spend that $66 million, but I know I got a lot of people on this team that need money and I'm going to start getting on the phone, hopefully. And maybe what I'll do, I'm going to up my bid on Nelson, try and guarantee Nelson. If I leave free agency with Nelson, that is a huge, huge addition. Okay, guys, I did exactly what I wanted to do in this free agency. I paid a bag. Um, I paid a crazy bag for a veteran who's going to help us in the run game. Welcome to the team, Zach Martin. You could argue a little, not, I don't think he's washed up. Obviously, as does, but he, he wanted to play for me. I'm happy that he wanted to play for me. And then I bring in Dean Leonard, who is somebody who I think is one of the better players in the game. 93 speed at six foot stud. Very much happy with my free agency. Eagles, what's good? What's up, bro? Okay, let's, uh, let's talk here. What's your, um, what's your mindset? Who, I guess, what do you what do you want? What are you as, as an eagle looking to move people? Who what who on my team interests you? That's what I'm trying to say. Jonathan Allen, I think that's who I want. You would want Allen. Yep. See, I, I would get. Lineman. He's someone I would get rid of. You'd pair him up with Jalen Carter. Yep. Give me what's the offer. I I can give up draft picks. I can give you a second round pick. Your two is 56. Oh, that's towards the end. Is that the best you can do? Uh, if you needed a position, I could toss in like a, like a third stringer or something. A third stringer? Like, like a get, corner or something. But you're, you're, okay. So your best offer is Jonathan Allen for a second. I won't do that, but I'll get back to you. I'm just going to make sure I look around first. All right. All right. Look around. Let me know. Okay, it's not, it's not a horrible offer. So a second and somebody. A second and somebody for Jonathan Allen, yes. Okay. Bet. I don't think that's enough. I don't know. Personally, I don't think that's enough. I got a deal for you. I'm going to say it once, and then I'm going to hang up. I'll give you, for Justin Jefferson, I'll give you Jonathan Allen and a future con considerations. What's the future considerations? I'll just consider you in the future. When I make trades. You know what, Brett? I don't, I don't think we can do that. Okay, not even with my future considerations. Yeah, we, we can't do that. Not, mm -mm. Okay, that's fair. That over here. I'm sorry. Yep. No, but I, I think you're, you're undervaluing the future considerations. 
Let's talk other things, okay? Who else on your team would you okay, move? Let's talk, to me. let's talk other things. I, I'm not. I just. I started high. I wanted to trade for him. I like that, you know. No, um, I like you too. And, you know what I'm saying? Um, but we are trading a couple people. Uh, Cameron Bynum. Bynum. Do you know um, how fast Cameron Bynum is? I'm just. I'm just curious. Do you know or no? He's he's, he's 86 feet. He's 86 feet. He's a little. He's a little on the slow side. He's good though. It, how cheap is Cameron Bynum? Because I look at him, I, I like Cameron Bynum. I think he's a high awareness guy. What could I give you for Cameron Bynum? I actually like Cameron Bynum. Um, a third would be good. Third would be good for him. You do a third for Bynum? You just don't like him because of his speed, huh? Yeah, he's, he's slow. He's super slow. See, I don't mind slow people. I think he's a good piece. I, I actually, I mean, I'll do a third. Deal. Okay, I'm about to accept right now. Hey, I'm there. happy with that. I feel like we're both happy. I don't, I'm not, I don't really care about speed. I care a lot more about awareness on defense. Okay, pleasure doing business, dude. Yeah, pleasure doing business, man. I think this was a steal. This is one that's going to be heavily, and I really want to ask the comments what you guys think about this trade, because I think you'll like this. Because you, I personally don't think speed's that important. I think I just got... A guy who's star development. He's 27. He's a little bit older, but he does a lot of things. Well, this is just a good safety who's going to help us. And I got him for a third round pick. He's 85 overall. I Meaning, if I get a breakout game with him, he gets abilities. I think this was a really underrated trade. One of my favorite trades I've done this year. Hey, dare I say it? I think that's one of my favorite trades of the entire year because he's a plug and play. Nobody cares about him because he's slow. But to me, I'm like, I actually think dude's kind of a stud, so I'm going to throw him up there. He'll probably take Quan Martin's spot just for now. Um, adds a little bit of toughness to our defense. Hey, I like that a lot. Good for me. 90 pursuit. He's going to be the shock of the season, I promise. What's up? What's up? Okay, I heard, this is just rumors, I heard your D-line's looking old, and you want to bring in a veteran X Factor Jonathan Allen. I just heard. This is all through the grapevine. Is this true? And my D line's old, but I want an, another old D lineman. <laughs> no, he's only 30. It's pretty old, Brad. I just don't. People in here are such ages. You guys are all about age. You think I'm just trying to get rid of Allen because he's old. He's, you came to me and said my D-line was old and then offered me a 30 You said my D-line was old. <laughs> Who do you want? Okay. I just, I will give you Jonathan Allen. I just want that pick 27. And that's generous of me. Like my management, if I called my management team, they would, they'd fire me if they knew I was making this deal. They would, oh, I'd be gone so fast. That's crazy. They, I'd be good. gone. I'd be in trouble. I'll give you a... A late third round pick. Oh yeah, you'll give me a late third round pick? Really? Yep. Oh, that's super nice of you. Really? You would do yeah. that? I would. Oh, nice. Okay. Let's talk about... Okay. Fair. You don't want him. What about you? You're such an age guy. What about Payne? He's only 28. I'm good. I hate trading with you. Alan for a third. Allen for a third. Yeah, cool. Okay, yeah, make all, um, you know what, actually, send that over. Hang it up. Allen for a third. The disrespect is absolutely bonkers that I am experiencing right now. But, hey, it's part of the fun of the league. Hey, you just keep swinging. Hope someone's going to answer and pick. It's going to be good. I want uh, Giants. I want pick two. I'm I'm less inclined because you're in the you're in the division, so the price goes up for you. Yeah, I know. Here's the deal: Travis Hunter's agent is actually going around saying that he will only play for the Commanders. Oh, oh, is he? He said that to a few different people. He, if you draft him, there's really no point in you even drafting him. <laughs> well, good thing I wasn't gonna draft him. No, but I'm saying if you do, if you think all the top five have all said they want to play for the commanders. That's why I want to offer you a deal. Okay? Mm. Your D-line is going to be so scary that people will 
I'm going to give you Jonathan Allen, Darren Payne, and my fourth. All I want is the number two overall pick in the draft. <laughs> Dude, listen. I like Jonathan Allen, even though he's like a dinosaur. You're right? a dinosaur, okay. But okay. Okay. I don't need Darren Payne. Really don't. I already have... Strongest guy in the NFL, on. but I guess that doesn't matter. No, I don't, because, you know, I just be able to make Jonathan Allen work capitalized. I can't make all three of those guys work. And a fourth? Come on now. Let's get serious. We're talking about the number two overall pick. We're talking you, about Travis You Hunter. tanked for that pick, and I know it. You tanked. I didn't tank for that pick, man. It's just this team is terrible. No, you man. tanked. You tanked. I, Daniel Jones is awful. I, I, you, I, I want to see what you do with Daniel Jones. I already have that franchise. I almost won the Super Bowl. But, okay, are you saying no to my number two overall? I'm saying we need to rework that deal. I like, I like <laughs> where you were. I like where you were with Jonathan Allen. You're going to have to come way with a way better offer than that. Okay, I'll think on it. I'm going to make a few more calls, but I'll think on it. All right. Okay. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I have struck out swinging. At least I didn't go out looking. I have struck out swinging on this entire draft. Um, meaning, we're picking where we're picking. We are picking where we are picking. So, guys, it's draft time. I I tried to trade with that. The best offer I got for... I'm not trading Allen for a second. It's just... To me, that's disrespectful. To Allen, it's disrespectful to my family. I still think I can draft good. I'm happy with my trade that I did for the third. Let's go make some picks. Dude took Jalen Milrow second overall. He said he was going to do something kind of crazy, and uh, he, was, <laughs> he was not lying on the phone. Jalen Milrow is a stud. He's super fast. He's the fastest quarterback in the draft class. So, Congrats to him for, uh, for getting Jalen Milrow. Okay, guys, our dreams of getting Travis uh, fall. Pretty quick. Travis Hunter goes to the Panthers, which is cool. I actually drafted Travis Hunter in my Panthers franchise last year. I think I've seen, and I've seen him with the Panthers a bunch. He's, he always seems to end up in Carolina. Travis Hunter is going to the Carolina Panthers. Hey, maybe I just need to keep making phone calls here. Luther Burden goes seven. Will Johnson goes eight. Um, yeah, a lot of the top guys are going right now. Ben Morrison, nine. Okay, we'll see who's there when we finally get to pick. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, oh, the long-awaited first selection is here. Um, this is an interesting, it's, it's interesting for me right now because I don't know who to take. There, there's players that I love. I love Ollie Gordon. Um, do I think that he's the selection? Absolutely not. Deion Walker goes one before. Tate Rutledge. I know this is a position of need. It would be the least flashy pick. Emory Jones is a baller. You got Landon Jackson, Tyreek Williams, Howard Cross. I like McCullough, but he's a third to fourth round projected guy. Barrett Carter. Jason Marshall Jr., the, the DBs are picked over. The safeties are still really good. And Kevin Winston Jr., I know, is really good. They're studs on the board. Um, I just don't know who the most valuable guy is. Isaiah Bond, he's still here. He's the only receiver still here. He's fast as heck. Isaiah Bond is kind of like a... I was not planning on going receiver, but I'm kind of shocked he's here. I usually He usually gets picked at like 15, but there's McMillan, there's Agbuka. There's so many guys with abilities. Do I just take... Do I just take a burner and just say, screw the O-line, let's get our quarterback a burner? This is a wild pick. Probably kind of where he would go in real life, guys. I am going to be selecting. Dang, I'm, it's him or Rutledge. I know Rutledge is the right move, but I just I really want Isaiah Bond. I know Rutledge is the move, but I really want Isaiah. And look, Rutledge Rutledge goes literally the pick after is Rutledge. Okay, so Isaiah Bond was ranked number 12 in True Talent. Oh my gosh. Ladies and gentlemen, 
this appears to be an absolute steal. 97 speed, 95 excel. Dude is a stud. You're gonna see probably highlights on the screen right now as I'm talking. I think this was a excellent, excellent pick. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, our second round selection. Um, someone who um, I feel like is so not flashy, it's disgusting. The, the interior line is is there. Like there, there is talent here with these interior linemen. Um, Jalen Walker from Georgia is still there. Barrett Carter's still here. A lot of, like, I like Jalen Walker a lot because he adds such a speed element. Like the 43940 is probably what intrigues me the most about Jalen Walker and random. This is a great draft class. Um, I also love Desan McCullough. Middle linebacker now, I used to use a six foot five with great speed. He's 6'5", with great speed at middle linebacker. It would be such a random pick. This guy used to be a safety, but 6'5", 223. I want to move Jeremy Chin, Chin to just chill. Part of me thinks McCullough is the best player, but I never pick... I'm in between three players right now. McCullough? Jalen Walker is going to be more of just an edge rusher. McCullough is younger and looks like he could go crazy, whereas Booker, I feel like I get a really good guard. And I don't have a third round pick because of my trade. I feel a little bit like I should go Desan McCullough. I just like his speed. I think the fact that he's that tall, he kind of gives me Barno vibes. I'm gonna do it. Welcome to the team, man. Welcome to the team. I think this, I'm shocking myself with this pick, but I think we got our guy. In some ways we did. He's six foot five. He's a very good football player. Um, 89 speed, okay. This is where he's a bit of a bust. He's 89 speed, 88 acceleration. This is my problem with him. He's bronze development. So you could argue that was a little bit of a bust, but I still think he'll be a stud for us. I like that speed for that size. He'll for sure play every single down. Welcome to the team, Desan McCullough. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are now in the fourth round. I I have small regrets over my, deci my decision, but I also think there's still decent value here. Um, there's the old Dominion, Jason Henderson. Shoot, I think I got my pick still. Wow, you can't, okay, I'm not mad. It happens. Commissioner accidentally skipped my pick. I have no idea who we got. No idea who we got. Jack Kaiser, who did we even draft? I don't even know who we drafted. I guess we'll see you guys round five. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are back up. Hopefully we don't get skipped here. Um, it definitely happens to everybody, so I'm not upset about it. It's just like, frick. Um, we got skipped. Ransom's been good for me in the past. I said to you guys going in, I wanted to have like kind of a good secondary running back with speed. And I think like, oh, someone said I can sort by speed. Wait, how do I sort? Sort. Sort. Wait a minute. I can sort by... No, I can't sort. I can sort by juke move, trucking, Coleman. I only got 28 seconds here. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Yeah, no, I'm cooked. Quez Hunter. Yeah, honestly, Quez Hunter is probably gonna be my pick. You know what, I'm taking the Liberty Kid. I actually like this guy. I'm, I'm a fan of this guy in real life. Yeah, I love this guy. On Liberty, I've used Liberty in the game. That, he's gonna be a good back for us. I like that pick. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, what an off season. I am, first off, wow. Holy frick! And Otis, shout out to that, shout out to the dude for skipping me. Otis is a stud. 
Otis is an absolute baller. Okay, we did well. McCullough is bronze, but a crazy good overall. Super swagged out. Super cool guy. 10 out of 10 cool. Isaiah Bond, deep threat, 97 speed. I think I killed this draft. So in this offseason, we add Bond, we add McCullough, we add Quentin Cooley, Rico Spindler, Jaheim Otis out of Alabama. This is who the computer picks for me. I would not have made this good a pick. Now, mind you, do we have the most D-line depth in the history of the world? Yes, but Isaiah Bond, we get a burner, we get a McCullough, we get an Otis, we get a Cooley, and we get a Rico Spindler. And then also, we add depth at safety by bringing in an absolute baller up top in Bynum. Like, I feel like Cameron Bynum is going to shock a lot of people this year. He's going to be a stud for us. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, great offseason. We're going to go through the preseason, get these guys reps, and then we get to see Jaden Daniels and Bond, which is going to be crazy. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, we got a lot to unpack here. We play Phantoms. I know this dude tanked. He said he didn't tank. He tanked for a high pick. 100% he tanked for a high pick. Um, and he got Jalen Milrow, who's a stud. So he got his quarterback. We got to deal with Jalen Milrow now. Um, very athletic quarterbacks in this division at this point. But we also got way better. I was disappointed in my first year with Jaden Daniels. I said it at the end of the video. I said it throughout this video. I feel like I let you guys a little bit down with that first season. It just didn't feel... There was lots about it that just didn't feel right. It just never really hit that perfect stride that I wanted it to. And for that reason, like, I'm, I'm optimistic. But I also did some things. I brought in a speed receiver, which we didn't have. That was something really important to me. We bring in Isaiah Bond, which I think Isaiah Bond, that's a good receiver. Like he's not probably going to be the top four receivers are just kind of in their league of their own in terms of just size, speed, everything. But we drafted well. I don't care what anyone says. I think both these players are going to help us tremendously. And I'm, I'm looking forward to seeing kind of what that looks like. How much can they help us? What can they do to make us better in the long term and short term. I'm excited for Ben Sinat. And Ben Sinat should not have been sitting last year. I'll own that. That's on me. I made a mistake. I decided to bench Ben Sinat, um, which was Sinat the right decision. I should have played him. I like Zach Ertz. I wanted to keep it realistic. But at the end of the day, Ben Sinat's the better tight end. I lost a year with him, but hopefully he did get better. Like he's clearly still getting um, points and stuff which is awesome now i want to go through the new roster mostly just the new rookies i'm really excited for Jaden daniels that's the first thing i want to say um all of his stats are so good and i think as the year goes on he's only going to get better so i think we can be pretty excited for what year two is going to bring for daniels i i'm i'm very pumped up because i, I know it's going to be really good running back um it's the Brian Robinson Jr. show now. And then there's also Quentin Cooley, who I, I really like. The, the kid from Liberty, I'm a big fan of, um, just because I play college football at 25. And Brian, this is a big year for him. It's kind of, it's, I'm trying to describe this year. It's his last year on his deal. I have to pay him. But like, I definitely still want to give him the ball. Our receiving core got a lot better. Um, we brought in James Bond. Isaiah Bond, 97 speed, 95 acceleration. Um, so fast, a true burner. And I never draft burners. Who was the last burner I drafted? Like to me, Bond, McCaffrey, McLaurin, that's a great three receivers right there. Like we were giving him what he needs. Line, did we address the line? Sort of, but not really. And I'm worried about the tackle position. Did we address the defensive ends? Sort of, but not really. Um, we still have the best two defensive tackles. I'm glad I didn't get rid of Allen. Um, we got a stud middle linebacker in Desan McCullough. And then we got Mike Sandstro, Ben St. Just, Emmanuel Forbes, Davis, uh, Dean Leonard, Allen George. And this was a big addition. Cameron Bynum, who I think I, is going to be a beast. Jeremy Chin, Percy Butler, and then we also, as you guys know, we got this DT, Otis, in the fourth round, who just happened to be really good. Whew. Going into this year, 
my plan is I want to I and I said it last year I want to run the ball and I want to be effective I want to be someone that is scary we got DJ backing them up Brian Robinson Jr. Austin Eckler still in there Terry Isaiah Bond I want McCaffrey to stay in the slot and Isaiah Bond I want him and McLaurin on the outside this is where we're just we're a bit of a dumpster fire on the line and it's not ideal, and I'm worried for Andrew Wiley. Former, like, I, I am. Ask me, are you worried? I am terrified to see what's going to happen with this line. I am. But there's nothing I can do about that, do about it at this point. It's just the way it is. I can't, I can't fix it. So, DB-wise, Ben Forbes, Michael Davis, Mike Sandstro, I like them all. Cameron Bynum up top with Butler. Those two kind of playing and working together. And then this is where it's interesting. McCullough's going to be my second user. So I always use her two players. Who knows? I might see how he moves. It's hard to not go with the guy I get six, got 16 picks with last year as my main user. Like, that seems ridiculous. But also, like, is it ridiculous? Because I could probably get 15 with McCullough. But my user was the best part of that entire franchise. So it, it is a bit of a difficult decision. I'm so excited for the Isaiah Bond debut. I'm so excited to see what we can do with Jaden Daniels. This is gonna be a fun season, high octane, fast paced offense um, that's gonna scare people, that's gonna scare me. I'm personally, I'm already scared to see what this guy's gonna do. So ladies and gentlemen, let's get it. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, it's a new season, new throw. colors. Honestly, I'm going up to James Bond on the very first play. Hey, I'll, I'll do that again. Not right now, like I'm gonna take a minute I'm not going to do it right now, but like, that's why he's on this team. I want to be more aggressive. Jaden Daniels was cheated out of a great season last year because of my inability to make good reads. And I don't want that to be the case this year. So, throwing now is Daniels. That's complete. I like that. Fourth down and six. I got to go for this. It's, it's early, I know, but I just feel like momentum wise, I don't want my first drive to be a, an absolute disaster. Got Laser. Good play. You work on fourth down situations as well. And deflating for the defense. You can't get this really well and giving up no creases. And they get him. Here's Daniels. Yep, scary Terry, laser. Good throw, right? Pat yourself on the head with your new haircut. Good job. They'll run for the first time here with Brian Robinson. Good run. Yeah, this will leave him and usually between run and pass. But in this case, with strictly the run game. To the air goes Daniels. He'll buy some time right. Thank you, Luke. I am your father, Luke. Thank you, Isaiah Vaughn. Perfect throw. Okay, Jaden Daniels early, and it's incredibly early. But like, this is the year where we take over the entire NFL. This is the year where I I put my like mark on the league as the go. There it is. Austin Eckler. Why is he in the game? Don't care. Seven zip. I, he, I don't play him last year when he has abilities, but now he's in the starting lineup without abilities. Perfect first drive. Luke McCaffrey, Bond, all helped out. Jaden Daniels was surgical. It's seven. Back to throw now on first down. You good, bro? No, for real. For real, you good, dude? Now Daniels. Yeah. Ben Sinat. To throw is Daniels. Isaiah Bond. And he comes back with one complete. Oh. And he's going to have a perfect ball. First down as they're able to get the Absolutely down perfect ball right there. I got Cooley in now. And oh, forget yeah. about finding a Second. lane. He barely had Off the play fake. Daniels. Himself to throw the ball. And as he tried to do that, he was hit. You got him. Jaden, just be on time. Be on time. And this is two what are you doing, man? Washington touchdown. Right That's a fancy a blitz. SS on blitz there. three. It's really cool. With it's fancy. It's fancy, but you got it. You don't want to move game. that guy on the right. The Over. Can't do that. 14-0. Perfect start. I promise you guys the Jane Downs experience. I'm 
promised. I was embarrassed. I watched the last one. I was embarrassed. This will be better. I promise. We can go to it. I think they did exactly that on that one. Oh my gosh. Good read, bro. Good read. Ben St. Just, he, St. Just, he should have got, um, he should have got a dev in the offseason. Like, he should have at least minimum went up to start. Oh, Wake up, kid. Wake up. I don't know what you're looking at, who you're talking to, what you're... What the heck is that? Horrible defense. They'll drop to throw. And it's intercepted at the goal line. Maybe this guy wasn't taking. Maybe he's... And the commanders will have the footprints here. Let's go ahead and turn things around. Let's you know what? Force. Isaiah Bond, you're earning it right now. He's earning his touches. Like, to find a way to win the game. dude's open. And I don't want to neglect all the great yards. other players we've got. And but. Yep, Eckler. Go for it. Coach is giving us permission. We played good all day. We got, we got permission to go here. On fourth down, here's Daniels. Luke, I am your father, Luke. Look at that catch, Drax. From the gun, he'll hand this up. Operating from the gun, Daniels. Operating from the gun, Daniels. This to McLaurin out of the left side. I would... And they're going to have another I would say we're borderline the there. At the Giants 29 yard line. I would say we are kind of and they're not going to get to the line. I wouldn't want to play us play. right now. So uh, that's all I'm going to say is I would not want to play. Now. They'll look to throw here on first down. Eluding the pressure right. Yep. Go to bed. Don't really stupid so go around. Quarterback and you don't see him. Sometimes you open up a big lane for him to hit you. Ah, oh, good defense. He's taken down. That's what I did last year. That's I got into trouble doing that last year, and I don't want that to be my identity this year. But I, I it definitely from the shotgun, he'll look to throw. Steps away to his left. He's different, man. I'm just He's different right now. Feel like I'm a great effort. Twenty one. Back to throw here. Oh, nice play. Inside the 30. Tip the cap. Not even where it happened. Oh, that was a gorgeous read. Okay. Still a little bit of time Malik left. Too neighbors. much time. If they can score here, they have a chance to make this a three possession game and all but put oh, things to bed. Down. Eckler has be been the most shocking of today. To because line. Eckler wasn't even and supposed to be my running back. Right now. He's just he just is. And that's why it's been so shocking is because I didn't intend on him even playing. And you can bet there'll be more where that came from as they try to ice this game away. There we go, Daniels. That is such efficiency. And he'll be taken down. That's what he is. He start to the year for this defense as they defend another behind the line. But you're right. You look at the numbers. Neither side looks on track in the ground game. And that is caught. Touchdown. Washington. I had all really short. This guy doesn't have to leave. Um, I don't know if you guys know in New York, they're famous for a lot of things. They actually make bubble waffles in New York. Bubble waffles initiated in London. Um, I think that's kind of where they became popular. I know me and my wife, when we were in Paris, we always have bubble waffles. This guy we just played in New York, he decided, he came up with the idea, I'm going to bring bubble waffles to New York. So he opens up his own bubble waffle stand. Um, he calls it Phantoms. If you guys are looking for it, you can go look for it. It's called Phantoms Bubble Waffles. And every single day, he's there in the morning making the dough, getting it all ready. Obviously, they make the waffle stuff, but you got to make the waffle batter to kind of go in, and then you buy the bubble machine. So this guy, um, he has to open. It's 342, it's 540 in New York. He opens for the evening bubble waffle shift in eight minutes. So he's got to go. I appreciate him playing. I hope you stay in the division with all my heart. Thank you for the effort. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, what an opening week. And I needed it. I just, I really need this season to be a movie. And like, maybe Bond is kind of the big play guy that we need. That's kind of what I'm thinking in my head. I'm like, is this what we needed? Someone who can break 
like break the secondary and make people not be able to press us have McCaffrey be more open because of it like there's other things that come from having a really fast receiver it's not all about having a fast receiver the run game gets better when you have a fast receiver these are two contracts I'm not gonna lie scary I might not bring you back depending on how it goes we got a lot of people I gotta pay a lot of interesting decisions that I kind of got away, but I'm not necessarily convinced that I'm about to pay dude. As far as the running back situation, um, for now, I'm gonna have Brian Robinson Jr. be my third down running back, because Eckler just seems like a bit of a waste, but it, it isn't, but it is. So, I'll kind of see how that goes. And then my slot receiver is gonna be Luke, not Terry. I want, Luke was so good in that role last year. I just, I have to have him back. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, it's Cowboys week. Week number two, ooh, I can do my week. Brett, remind me guys, why aren't you doing your weekly strategy? Oh, thank you so much for asking. I don't know why I didn't, but I'm glad you reminded me. I'm gonna do it right now, I just did it. Um, weekly strategy looks like Terry, um, Terry should have an upgrade based on what I saw, no joke. I never thought I'd see the day I hit 90. I never thought I'd see the day I hit 90. Okay, so with 90, ooh, I gotta, I love spin cycle. I'm not, I'm not sacrificing spin cycle. What can I get that I couldn't get before? Lofting, fast break, anchor, jukebox, no look. That's a wild set of abilities, but I wanna be protected. Okay, let's go. Okay, get out of there, Luke. This is where Luke's got to be a little bit more of a Christian than a Luke. And I... Those are easy plays. I'm going to still have him play the slot, even though I could have McLaurin. But when I run this scheme, um, the running gun, which is we're bringing in for Jaden Daniels in this next year, it's going to be a lot of that. Oh, they are getting bricks. Oh, my gosh. Terry. I love you, Terry. Well, and that was DB down. Fire 2. Just broken DB Fire 2. Well, that was still get a first down. totally and broken. Walk. First and 10, they go from the 11. Oh my gosh! Nice Ooh, what a spin! What a spin! Fall forward. No, he doesn't have it. Three. Ooh, okay, this is where we gotta have something for 33. That's not good. Brian, please! Brian! Brian! Don't kick it! This isn't rugby. Oh, first mistake of the franchise. I don't that that one's not really on me. Well, it probably is more on me than anybody else. But shoot, I hate that with the speed option. I love speed option. It's my favorite thing. Why did it, it just doesn't love me? A shotgun snap for Prescott. Yep, got him. Good job. That was totally bad. By Forbes. Well done. Forbes three. To box. You, can, you want to keep playing like that against CD Lamb? Please do. Oh man, Jaden's gone. Jaden is gone. Somebody say bye to Jaden. Send him your postcard. Right, in, like he is. Should I? Well, he wasn't gone. But I thought he was going. I'm going to run this same play again. That, that, might, be, that might be the move. Okay. Might not be. Luke. Again. Luke McCaffrey. Down to the one. He's got two for 42 to start this game. I love that guy. Yep. That's fine. Okay. 7-0. Be great. They've got to hit the plays when they have them. They want to have a chance to leave here with a win. Oh, and Chin almost came out of left field. Bleachers to get there. They're indeed going for it. It's Prescott. Too short. This is a, this is a defensive. Spending. This guy hasn't gained... You know, Mike, you could almost just like, look down the huddle and excellent, the players are excellent, the excellent defense. Mike. On second down, it's Daniel. Oh, he 
he goes. From the shotgun on third down, Daniel. He's got his tight end. I like that throw. I like that throw a lot. A gift, and here comes Robinson. Heads up, Brian. And that'll operating from the gun. It's Daniel. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Go now. Wait, 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 wait. Go now. Go now, Jaden. That's my MVP this year. I'm calling my shot. I really am. I'm gonna win MVP with that kid. It's gonna happen. Don't don't freak out when it does. I want you guys to play it cool, but I'm winning MVP with him. Dak gonna throw it here on first down. Let's it go. Downfield for Ferguson. Operating from the gun. Here's Dak. Open man. Downfield. It's CD Lamb. Yeah, we'll time up. Oh, okay. He's figuring something out. I don't know what he's figuring out, but he is figuring out something with my defense. I, I like Bynum. Hit him, Bynum. Oh, he just tore his Achilles. Who was that? This is everything has to be about protecting the football. Your heart drops when that ball slips out of your hands. And in this case, no choice but to just tuck it down himself. And he's able only to pick up a short game. That's a nice see. Whoever got that hit stick potentially saved some points. I don't know who it was, but whoever got it definitely saved us a little bit. Prescott to throw it on fourth down. He's boxed. Ladies and gentlemen, defensive master class. He was a yard away from making this a game. We just didn't allow it. Like, this is this is beautiful. So far, this has been beautiful. I don't know if he's got a read defender here. Yep, he's got this in place. On play action, Daniels. He'll tuck it and take off. Good job. Here's a design run. He... They'll go play action here with Daniel. Oh, he did that. Second down, Prescott. That... On third down, Prescott. He'll take a shot down the middle of the field. And he will go Dang. That was a dog, dude. Frick. Okay, we got a game, folks. We get ball. I felt comfortable on offense all day, so I'm not necessarily... I'm not worried that I can't move the ball, but I definitely don't love keeping up plays. On first and ten, here's Daniel. Oh, there's running room here. Oh. Hmm, I easily could have been gone right there. Yep. Good job, Brian. Move up, second three. And that keeps a second down. Now you have equal opportunity to both run. Yep. Luke McCaffrey just is developing into the best. Did you see that route? Clip that route. We got so many weapons, it's insane. Like, I love it. Great route, Luke. Great route. Short kick taken just inside the He's gone. He's more than gone. He is gone, gone, gone. And he will dive into the end zone. Oh gosh. Throwing on second down. Daniel. You know what? Oh no, Brett. What the heck was that, Bon? Oh my gosh. The rookie just bailed out his quarterback and what I could have been my first pick of the year. I got bailed out of that. Okay. Thank you, Bon. Thank you, thank you. Daniel's now gonna look to throw. And he's gonna the cross screen was so bad. And the man I called that, that was good. To play another down. Instead, he retreats backwards and 
leads to a massive loss. That's mm. gonna be caught. Hang on, my girl. Go for the win. If I get this, it's probably over for him. And I've been playing good enough to where there's no reason for me not to be confident enough to do this. On fourth and goal. That's Michael Parsons. I'm close. Oh, right from the time I snapped that ball, I knew I would have to do something crazy to even have a hope. Oh, yeah. The Cowboys have made a game of this, and I was hoping they would not be making a game of this because it did not look at one point like they were going to be making a game of this. But now that I've totally sold, I got to get this thing back. They'll keep it on the ground. Second down throw for Prescott. A short. Prescott now. Yep, yeah, he's bag for oh, Okay. I feel like this guy is not good against the blitz. With time, he's pretty good. Against the blitz, he's pretty bad. I feel like I need to send this game out. Let's send you. You're gonna go here. Now or never, they'll throw on fourth down. He'll try to run for it. There you go. Mm, nice play. Had the drive by picking up the first down with his legs. Great job by the quarterback understanding. Get out of bounds. Stop the clock. See. They'll drop the throw. He's going to let one go. Deep for Lamb. A shotgun snap for Prescott. There you go. Nice play. Ooh, this thing is a little closer than I would like this thing to be. It's a little closer than I would like. And on the back for a loss of yards. That's a bad close From the shotgun, it's Dak. You'll be team. Everybody talks about two minute. Everybody drills it every single week. But when it comes down to this moment in the game. Your quarterback needs oh, thank you, game. That's a big miss. Big miss. Prescott again. Ten yards. A first down throw for Prescott. And that ball. On second down, it's Dak. He got me again. This is a great human interaction on why you don't take people lightly. Dak to throw. Prescott. Oh wow, that was cool though. You don't see those very. Much. That was a true just back shoulder fade. Back to throw is Prescott. He doesn't have anything. He knows it. He knows it. I know it. Use that time up. Okay, this is about to come down to one snap of the ball. I gotta be usering Jeremy Chin. I'm telling myself exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm usering Jeremy Chin. I'm taking everything away. All the smash routes, whatever I can do, take it away. Here we go. One final play. And this is a touchdown. I got no hate in my heart for this guy. That's just, that was a great read. That was a great read. Zeros on the clock. An inverted. Okay, let's, let's do this then. Round two. Operating from the gun. This play was legitimately impressive. Watch my user. I follow that. As soon as I follow these drags, I was he throws that. Good game. Okay. We still played amazing, but that was just a crazy comeback, and I was on the wrong side of it. It is what it is. Good game, man. Shoot. I am, uh, wow. I'm a little speechless. A little bit. But... It was a good wake up call. Like you can't, just cause I was up big and everything was going well, I was spinning. It doesn't mean this is gonna be easy. Now, the good news is our stats and like my confidence level is still an all time high. I get to play that guy in a week. I feel like we can we can win. I really do. We're, we're, we're still playing really good football. 
It's just that game. It just to, and say what you want. I was on his five yard line. He hadn't moved the ball well. In my mind, I'm like, if I get this, it's over. If I don't, he's got to go 95. And I didn't expect it to be 95 for the win. And it just so happened to be 95 for the win. Like, tip your cap to that guy. I'll take the percent. And Micah Parsons with the shed that he got, that was bananas in the first place. So we get a chance against the Broncos to kind of get our swagger back. Sometimes you're making the joke, and sometimes you are the joke. I, I was the joke right there. Uh, in that game, hardcore. Okay, um, we're gonna think on that, and we're gonna think on this, and we're gonna think on that, and we're gonna think, like, I'm gonna think on all these. I don't know really at this point what I'm gonna do. All I know is I better beat the Broncos today because I do not wanna be one and two with the trip with Dallas coming to town at all. To throw is Knicks. Escaping the danger, throwing and completing. On the carry, it's Williams. Come on, mm. escape. From the shotgun, here's Nix. Are you? No, are you kidding me? Like, what if who is on? Are Bo Nix is not Bo Jackson, speed wise. How the heck did he get out of that? Oh, I'm starting to become a hater. It's because I'm struggling. Here's Nick's to throw. Good defense. Second down. down he... Second down. Nick's. Off balance throw. It's complete. Third down. Open man left side is Brown. He's got okay. seven zip. This looks like a design run. And hey, he's not fumbling. Jaden, I want you to run. I want you to win the MVG. So for my, but I also just, you can't fumble. We can go crazy, we just, we can't fumble. Oh, I got him. Operating from the gun, it's Daniel. Play action, Daniels. He'll air it out down the middle. Over the middle and intercepted. Picked up by Justin Reed. And the Broncos. Did, did you guys see who that was supposed to go to? Line. That was supposed to get to Luke when McCaffrey. You find yourself in this situation, Mike. You're on defense. You're Why was that so short? Line. I don't. He could have been exhausted. He took two hit sticks. And play and get off the that field. is. Exactly that was play. maybe the most underthrown ball I've ever seen. Okay, everybody. Welcome to. This is going to be a little, be a little more interesting than I thought. He connects with Mims. Mims is not good. On first down, here's Nick's to throw. They'll throw. It's Nix. And he's going to... It'll be a run out of the gun with Williams. Throwing is Nix. That's out to Brown. Right side. Complete. Our tackling? And they're going to be set up. We barely got that tackle. Oh, goodness, guys. I am... I'm in trouble. I am... This Broncos user is playing out of his mind. He's outplaying me completely. Yeah, he just caught me. Okay. We got to score. We got to score quick. We got to score efficiently. We got to score now. My gosh. This is going to get interesting. Shoot. They'll go play action here with Daniels. Throw it. That's a better throw. Hey, even though that's incomplete with 18 seconds left, I, I can live taking that risk. That's a calculated risk. That's what I like. But that's a good risk to take. I want Bonds here. Working out of a gun, it's Daniel. On third down, he'll throw with Daniel. Time, time, time. 
from the shotgun. It's Daniel. Yep, Luke. Luke, 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 Luke. Okay. We get ball at half. That was good. That was a good two plays. I think I just got to focus on scoring. I got to score quick. Man, oh man, I thought for sure I had at least three there, but I don't. That's it. That's it. Nice play. I lost my button on my switch. I have, a, I have a button like this. I don't know where it is. It's driving me crazy. I gotta find that button. Daniels now on first down. That's one on one. I like Luke McCaffrey. Ah, oh, Luke, catch it, buddy. Off the zone read. Daniels gonna hang on to it. Good decision. Third and two. Here's Daniels. They'll indeed go. It's Daniel. I'm out. How the heck do we ever win? Off the RPO, they'll get it to Brown. They'll go with William. And he's going to Brown. And the offense is able to pick up the first down. Natalie. Throwing. Nix. But catch made there by Sutton. Eight in the fourth quarter. We've got to keep this clock He's killing moving. the clock now. You don't want to risk an incompletion now. They convert. He's killing the clock and he's just, just taking the breath out of this team. We got a, we got next week to bounce back or else this could be a rough season. And I still don't feel like I've played that bad, which seems crazy. I just don't feel like this is that bad. It's not good. But we haven't had a lot of good bounces, and hopefully that can correct itself. But man, it sucks to have this record. We're gonna be one and two with, and we gotta play someone who just beat us. It's another run here for William. And nice work. They'll drop to throw. Find him. And freaking Nims out of left field. Like what? I thought that was the book of the year. Yeah, and he's killing clock. This thing's gonna be all over, but the crying in a minute. The most disparate thing is to kill clock, but he's still throwing it. Like he still wants to throw the ball, but he's killing clock. Got it into the hands of Mims. To throw is Nix. He's got it inside the five. And the Broncos are going to have a first and goal. Okay. Very nearly a touchdown. He's going to be marked out of bounds no, just Brett. shy of the pile. I'm 27 years old. And I just got dotted. And he's One not going to. One more time for William. This is going to be. Guys, this is not where I wanted to be. Um, that last game I got zero points, but I, I, funny enough, even though I got zero points, I didn't feel like I played that bad. Like, I'm not freaking out, when maybe I should be. Like, there's, there's parts of me that thinks I should be freaking out. Parts of me that think, okay, there's a lot of things going wrong, but I actually don't believe that. That game, I just got dotted. The entire game, I was dotted the whole time. That I know. But I actually don't feel like statistically we're bad enough to where we're in panic mode yet. If we get to panic mode, I've never done it before because I'm usually pretty good at this stupid game. But if we get to panic mode, I'll trade Terry, I'll trade Allen, and I'll try and get picks and we'll rebuild around Allen for the next 10 years. I don't know. But all I know is this game matters a lot. A lot. So we better win it. Cowboys rematch. They'll run for the first time here with Brian Robinson. Back to basics. Good job, guys. One play at a time. We're a good football team. I got to remind myself of that. Hi, I'm Brett. I play for a good football team. That's what we're doing. Brian Robinson Jr. Head down. Tough yard. Boom, boom. That's what good football teams do. They've taken care of that early. Escaping the pressure right. Now Daniels, if you make that throw, you're elite. That's elite. That is so elite. Boom! Good play. We're back. I want to beat this guy by 50. He embarrassed me in front of all you guys.
I want to beat him by 50. Yeah, I told you guys, it's personal with this guy. But not personal, like I still think he's a good person. I'm sure he's a nice guy. I hope the best for his family, but he really embarrassed us. And I didn't like it, so we're screaming every single play against him. Now Prescott on fourth down. Pass he just taken got, in by yeah. his big tight end. He's in the space past the 25. He's still on his feet. Find him. He's not fast. Okay. Seven up. Neighborhood. Well, they go play action. Daniels. Daniels. Oh, my gosh. That is. Good job, Bond. Now he'll go down, but not before I was, I was under, under significant pressure, and we somehow made the throw. Thank you, game. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. I love you. That's what made this play a success. Quarterback had to wait for his crossing route to develop. To throw is Daniels. Man open is Robinson. And he takes it in for a commander's touchdown. Who would have thought that? Who would have thought that? Jr. Brian Robinson Jr. Touchdown. There's Prescott. Flushed out right. That, my friends, that's a skill move. That's a skill move. That is a skill move. Did you see how I clicked off and clicked back on? It's a skill move. Okay, guys, having the game of our season so far, let's keep it up. Nothing stupid. Keep it up. In this case, he was not, and it turned into disaster for them. Is that CMC or LMC? Causes the most problems for a defense because there's a breakdown in communication there. When that Again, it'll be Robinson. And he goal. Now Daniels. Under no, pressure, down he goes. No, I'm not going to make the same mistake Second twice. Okay, two o'clock. It's all right, 10 point and lead. And the 12-year throwing. Prescott. Prescott. Quick hitter here. It's complete. Here on third down. To throw is Prescott. Eluding the pressure right. And I think the ball's out. But this that was the most vicious, out of malicious, see inside his face mean hit I think I've ever leave. seen. He coughed it up, but it goes out of bounds. They keep it. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, him, he gets three. Lottery after that, but honestly, a very fun. fortunate man. And they're still operating in plus annuity and be able to make some of these plays. That's such good defense. What did I tell you? Screaming at him the entire game. With no... No regret, no care. I don't feel bad. My heart doesn't hurt. I don't. I feel nothing. I just want to scream in the Please. Fourth down, Prescott. He's gonna try and go deep again. You gotta have somebody. Not somebody. Both of them played great defense. Predictably, somewhat predictably, it doesn't. Now we get our swagger back. A little bit of jet sweep, a little bit of read option, go up two scores, win the game. Motion right. He's going to handle it on the touch pass. Working out of the gun, Daniels, flush to his right. On the run, he'll let this go deep right side. Throwing now is Daniels, escaping the pressure right. On the run, he'll so, let this go deep. There's a chance on that. I'm in the same situation I was before. Oh, the game's even telling me to go. To come so. through the completion there. Now because the game's telling me to go position. for it, you go. There's enough time. I'll have I'll have hope. And he's not moving the ball good enough where I should be worried. Daniel's gonna throw for it. I'm gonna be just fine. The core and the sideline and put ten. And from the shotgun, it's Daniels. They'll roll him out right. Yeah, you should have Bond right in the middle. Going left side here, and it's and complete. They'll wind up this guy scared me so badly. I think I'm going to try and kill a little back clock. Now Just because I'm terrified field. of losing. I can't it's lose Washington with the football He's and not the good lead as we... Robinson will try to pick it up. And he 
takes it in. Touchdown, three three, 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 three. Brian Robinson Jr. His first rushing touchdown on the year. First and rushing. The I think he's got three like touchdowns today. They're going to get back in the win column as they extend their lead. Looking to throw. Prescott flushed out right. Got a man and he Oh, nice. Strike. Good angle, Brett. Yeah, nice angle, kid. Get this one Just get a figure eight loop de loop Just around him. Horrible toy. angle. Here for first and ten. Now Prescott. And this ball is caught by Lamb. Touchdown, Dallas. I hope that this is a game. I hate that this a is a game. A great effort there. Yeah. His second touchdown on game. the season. Prescott, they're going to throw for it. That's caught. And the Run Cowboys this have ball made it a one-score game. Again. Robinson with another carry. Pushing okay. his way through. And he's got Robinson. If this isn't a breakout game... I'm punching myself in the face. If he doesn't get a breakout from this, this game sucks, and everyone who plays it sucks. This is a. There's no one's ever deserved a breakout more than Brian Robinson. He has like a hundred on the air, one fifty on the ground. He's been everywhere. I gotta go for this. Take one step. Daniel's gonna slow. try and throw for it. Oh my, my controller gets. He's gonna go down. You think I'm wrong? Can't get rid of it. Been worth the wait. It's third down here. And this is intercepted, and that should do it. Picked off by Emmanuel Forbes, and the Commanders are gonna take. This guy doesn't have to leave. Um. Well, he doesn't actually have to go in Dallas. I don't know. Have you guys been to Dallas? I've been to Dallas. At the Dallas Cowboys Stadium, they actually offer tours where you can go tour the stadium. It's a beautiful stadium. You get to walk around the entire stadium with a paid guide. This is the guide. So Monday to Thursday, 2 p.m. to 6 p.m. if you get a tour, I fear for you, this gamer tag is the guide. It's 535. His last tour starts in four minutes. He's got to show all the... So he's got to go. Thank you for playing, though. Thank you. Bottom of my heart. Thank you. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I just want to keep on winning. No breakout for Brian Robinson Jr. We'll talk, but yeah. Somehow, 150 yards on the ground and 80 yards and four touchdowns isn't enough for a breakout. Hopefully, I might actually try and keep up the momentum and run a bunch with him again, see if we can maybe trigger a breakout this game. Packers week, let's get it. On the zone read, here's Daniels. Oh, I can run with that. Honestly, I think I thought I had the angle. I mean, yeah, I kind of feel like I had the angle on that. I pulled it. It looked right. I just kind of got worked into that tackle, unfortunately. That was just kind of unfortunate luck, I think. You can disagree, but I think that was a bit of bad luck. Okay, now we're going to go a little bit more of a guaranteed play. And by guaranteed, I mean loss of four play. Okay, yikes. Not the start I wanted against Green Bay. Uh, it's, it's fourth down. I feel like you got to... Like you... You can't live with regrets. I mean, because that was fourth down, I feel like that justified me playing that as aggressive as I did. And also just the fact that... You know what? Have a day, Brian. He's so clunky, though. Like, he's just not... I don't know. I need to, I need to get him to Superstar to see him with moves. But he's he's a little clunky, Brian Yep. It's a good run. Still a negative one, even with two good runs. Oh, okay, this is my second fourth down. Okay. Maybe the worst side of the year, but I want to get to the Growing to begin is love. Back to his big tight end. It's a hit. 
first down for him, but it's a big hit for us. And those will, at some point, turn into fumbles. Out of the shotgun, it's love. Left, left, and Okay, Commanders. Uh, yeah. Time to move the ball. Is he in kind of a weird one right now? He's gotta settle down. Have some more efficiency on these early downs. And beyond box. It's, it's another it's another word. I don't think box really does it justice anymore. I'm getting popped is what's going on right now. They'll indeed go. It's Daniel. Oh, I can't move. I can't do nothing. Look, I don't think I've gained a yard. I don't think I've gained a single yard, and that blitz is just killing us. On first and ten, here's love. Is into the hands of throwing on second down. Love this one caught at the floor, and he will power his way into the end zone. Mike Gesicki, you know where to hide, bro. You know Green Bay. Don't hide anywhere. You're here. Daniels to throw on second down. He'll look. Of plays I don't give myself an excuse for I don't think I've ever been boxed up so bad. I can't run, I can't pass. I, I don't know who I am anymore. Like, this is true pain. And this guy's not even good. Like, I don't know what. He is good. I, that's that's dumb to say, but. Love to throw on first and ten. Taken in by Gasicki. Shannon, can one of those just be a fumble, please, 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 please. Make plays, and that was a good one there. He's got the sickie. Just pour it on. Just pour it on. This is gonna be our second game. If I don't get a point, this will be my second game of the year without a point. This offense, this firepower. Not a point. It's embarrassing. I gotta figure it out, and I'm sorry, but it, it will. I will figure it out, but this is humiliating. Love to throw it on first down. He'll go left side here. You want to get points? Ideally a touchdown, but either way, you have the ball left. From the gun, it's Love. That is... Let me sleep. This guy's putting me right to sleep. He gets it this to is go. the worst game of and my career. Oh my gosh, I'm getting smacked. First half I'm getting smacked. I might have to get out of the speed option offense. From the shotgun, it's Daniel. Thank you, Daniels. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Just for my own personal, like I just needed that. Just for, just so I knew I could still get a completion. My goodness, a completion. The quarterback loved his matchup. He allowed his receiver to work downfield. Perfect. Daniels now going to look to throw. Every story has. I honestly might throw in DJ just to save his stats. Like, what are we? I think DJ might go in legit. Just trying to save face. This is 2018. This is 2018. Because their this is 28 to nothing. At a high level if they don't have confidence in this passing game. This is 28 to 7. On first down, it's love. Short pass taken in by the tight end. Now love. Little short pass here, caught by his tight end. Love to throw. The open man is Reed. He's got it. And it'll be... Here's Love. That is brought in. 
Back to throw is love. He pulls it in around. Open that stuff. That's not a good read. That that could be a pick. It wasn't, but that definitely could. The drag route is such a good way to get in some world. A second down throw for love. Big hit. To throw is love. He's obviously going to go for it on fourth, which means if he goes for it, he doesn't get it, we get seven quick. We're technically, it's a two-score game. We onside kick, get it back, onside kick, get it back. We're, we're still in it. They'll go for it. We are mathematically up. Guys, I am so unbelievably sorry for the performance that you just saw that that was embarrassing and i'm gonna fix it i i actually before that game was feeling like this season was going so incredibly smooth and one game well honestly a couple games i've just lost my swagger i've lost my momentum and i've lost who i was as a person i don't know if i've lost that but like i do feel like man those games were brutal so I think what I need to do here is really put the training wheels on just completely and do everything I can to win. I think that's kind of the way I'm looking at things right now is like, I am no longer able to spin. I'm no longer able to, because now we're not even looking at a playoff spot. Maybe I'm a little overconfident with Jane Downs. Maybe I'm not. I don't know. I have still have Isaiah Bond. We still can be a high powered offense. I'm going to switch playbooks. I'm going to go to maybe a little bit more of a friendly passing playbook. And I'm going to try and get this thing back on track because, man, we are not on track right now at all. Week six. Because this is what you prepare for. This is what you practice for. This is what you think about. The ultimate test. There on I'm bagged. Down, forcing the I am. Oh, my gosh. Fourth okay, bro, what are you doing so wrong? Like, you're definitely doing multiple things wrong. Well, send the tight end in motion. Let's just try blocking up and see if I can just get it to He's going to float this one deep right side. Touchdown, Washington. A big play there. Laser. Here's McCarthy. Good play. Throwing is McCarthy. This is caught by Addison. Oh, okay. Looking to throw McCarthy. Two to the catch to the jostling from the defender. And he's going to go down. down. McCarthy, he'll set to throw it. And he's got this to possession. Good play. This one right back Second in the down. hands of now McCarthy. Good, good play. Third down. To the air with McCarthy. He's got his man. It's taken in for a Viking touchdown. Hmm. Josh Oliver. Oh, yeah. Hit the end of the route, and that one winds up incomplete. Slings this deep from McCarthy. We're McLaurin. just we're just gonna start being the most. This is caught. We're going to start being the most aggressive passing team in the league because we stopped caring. I lost all my cares last game. I'm just going to make Jaden the guy. From the shotgun, it's Daniels being chased out left. Oh, this is... To throw is Daniels. He's a dot. He's got it. That's a dot. Backed up late. They're forcing incompletions and fighting to keep him out of the end yeah, zone. Yeah, you're good, you're good. And he takes it you're good, you're good, you're good. Good. Another incompletion. Oh, he's good got try. his target. That's complete. Almost got him. Again, he'll drop to throw. Catch is made by Hawkinson. Throwing again, McCarthy. They're going back to the same well. It's They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw over the middle. Back to throw again. That's a pick. That's a pick. That's a pick. That's what we needed. That's a pick. That's a pick. That's what we needed. Good job. Oh, Bynum. Cameron Bynum. The non-flashy pick that Brett made. I love him. I love a breakout with him. I really would. Now Daniels. 
Yeah, that one. You need to put some heat on it. It helps have the big gun. In this case, just a little bit too much. No. Operating from the gun. McCarthy. This one swung out here. Back to throw now on first down. Good play. Second down. Working out of the gun is McCarthy. Drops it to Jones in the flat. Yeah, he's short yardage call. If you're the offensive coordinator, you like looking at that section a heck of a lot better than trying to figure. Looking to throw. McCarthy. And be able to make some of these plays that they have not been doing so far. And that'll be caught by Third down. Tony. They'll look to throw again. Okay, he's going to be taken. They'll indeed go. Here's McCarthy. And he's brought That's bag. Good job. It actually was on the clock. This to Mc Daniels looking to throw. Yep, that's wide open. That's down wide open. Line. This was a very... Down the left side road. This game was back to basics. I just dropped that. Snap. I, I think I stopped waiting so long to throw. That can be a big... Trap to fall in when you wait so super, like that, super, super long time to get rid of that. First down, straight ahead, it's Robinson. And okay. managing third guy in, rake it the football, get it out. We've got to create a turnover because one more score, and this game's over. There. Here's Daniels. Flush to his right. Dot. Looking for McCarthy, he'll set to throw it. With the dot. Toward the sideline. Good play. Look at that catch. Dragging the oh, okay. We don't have to do anything crazy well here to win this game. I just pretty much can't mess up. To put this simply, like, I think I probably win this game as long as I don't do anything rash or super out of line. This this Here's is definitely McCarthy. gonna be a dub. Addison holds it in. Now McCarthy. And this is intercepted. Yes, and that should do it. I'm happy. Yeah, Benjamin Benjamin. St. Jo that one looks like he'll throw here. Should have Bond. Bond should be able to outrun five. He does too. Good caught. game, Brody. We're back on the seven. We need to do it. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Coming off of a nice dub. You know, Jaden has his worst game ever. And then the next game, he has his best game. How funny is that? I'm laughing. It's hilarious. It's funny. Um, dude went from his lowest point to his best point. And I'm feeling good. I'm feeling confident going into this week. This dude's good. Um, he's really good at the game. He beats me most times. And I know I'm, I'm saying that now, and that's a very pessimistic outlook on a game. My voice cracked. I apologize if you guys didn't hear that. Um, it's a very pessimistic outlook because I should be going into this thinking I'm winning no matter what, but I know this guy's pretty good at the game. So I understand that I have to play really well in order to get it done. It was nice last week to see Jaden's stats get a little bit better. 11 and 5 looks a lot better. And Isaiah Bond is a target that I can trust. So going into this game, trust our weapons, be smart, and get a win. Drive begins with a run. It's Robinson. Good job. I like that, Brian Robinson. Every game, and the fun thing about these, when you struggle at the start, every game becomes must win. Oh, I'm gone. I am gone. Isaiah Bond! Let's see if everything goes wrong. Nice guy. Comment. I don't know what stuff that's like. Comment it down below. Throwing right away here. First down. Good play. Uh, Benjamin St. Juiced up stats lately. Good job. Out of the gun, Daniels. He knew what I was doing. Yeah, he, he knew the route. He switched it. To, uh, that's, 
Brock I hate that because you just feel like you got played, man. Well, Brock, if you like I got defense, played, you man. I got played. Right he knew what route I was doing from the Terry was wide open. I could have thrown a streak for a touchdown. Well, let's see here, kid. We got oh, one. I hate this we guy. Got two. I hate On first down, it's gone. Escapes the pocket. Shotgun snap here to go. Come here. Third down and 17. Okay, that is an absolute snuggle. That defense. Great execution. Out of the shotgun. Go. He throws a bullet deep to the right. He's got it deep down here. Try to undercut it. It's a good read. Yep, that's there again. It's there again. I know it's there because it's cover three. That's, that's trust, though. Like, that's not just happening. That's me knowing. Finding trust as the year goes on. I'm trusting the speed, and I'm trusting his arm in between zones. And the, it's risky, but it also can be huge reward. 14-7. He's still trying to scream at me a lot. I might have Bond here just quick. second and eleven. Have a day, man. Have a day. You're you're kind of cooking right now. And I, if you can, just continue to catch absolutely everything I throw at you. Luke McCaffrey, yes sir. Let's go up top. All the great passing game going on right now. From the gun, it's Robinson. You can feel it from the jump, and that call from the defense, that came at the perfect time. Yep. I don't think he could stop this run. Robinson on the inside give. And he's brought down. Evidently. He could. Famous last words is, is I don't think he could stop this and run. That's all they've got for what and then he very obviously stops you felt it needed for a first down. Stud. Stud. Luke McCaffrey. Stud. So that the one. Perfect. 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 This is maybe a wild play call, but I'm doing it. Austin Eckler. That sometimes... It's a veteran who comes in in a big play. You tell Brian Robinson, sit, okay? I'm bringing in the start of 88 speed short veteran. And that's exactly what I did. And it's 21-14. Perfect drive right there. Perfect. Shotgun snap, looking to throw. He's trying another one deep. He's got it. Why is that so good? What's going on? What is going on? Why is that burning me like that? He's on the move. First down from the red zone. Begged. After the sack, another pass on second down. Yep, got him again. Okay, get this man paid. Pay him. Pay him. That's like four picks in two weeks. He is an island. He's playing like Richard Sherman right now on the right side. St. Juice. Nope. Not, you just, and guess who? It's Mr. MVP. That's kind of, that's, they're calling him that. That's kind of what names you. Everyone has their own name for him. People are calling him Mr. MD for plays like that. Daniel's on first down. Yep. This ball's cut by McCaffrey. Luke McCaffrey, well done, sir. Back to throw. Here's Daniel's. It's a real question mark. Will it lead to more, or will this offense learn a lesson and get back to the rhythm they've been in protecting? From the red zone now. Four 
Stab to his right. He's keeping the ball. A defender made the recovery. Yeah, sometimes that sideline's a player's worst enemy, mm -hmm. but sometimes it could be their best friend, and this is one of those times where that's best friend. Jesus. So let me have one nice thing. Why do you have to pick me with Jack Campbell? That was going to be a clip. Okay. Fine. We're probably going to win. But. Okay. I hope that play doesn't come back to bite me because it was an unnecessary play. Like, I didn't have to spin around like that. There was no reason for me to do that. But it is what it is. I'll live with the consequences if we lose. First down, it's gone. To throw again here, second and ten, it's gone. He throws a bullet deep to the right side. What a play. And he's the play in the end zone and a beautiful job by the defender to knock it away. Desperation time here on four. Come here, great defense, guys. Great defense. This is a player I struggle against. Like I, I would say my win percentage against him is 7%. I, I don't normally beat this guy, so I'm honestly just pumped and psyched that we should be leaving here with a win, no matter what. So that that's good. He's going to burn his timeouts here, but we're, we're realistically a first down for them. Well, this guy's really 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 not going to put the defense to where it's well, we like, understand as many times you're running that play action because of the great protection. Yeah, I'm you're actually trying to get it. I don't know why I'm running 30 yards back. Just game. get me out of this game. Truly, just get me. I, I don't know. I'm boxed. Well, if I lose, I lose. I'm going to take right knees if I can. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Still should have at least thrown it up there and given somebody an I don't know what is going on. Okay. Get me out of here, please. Get the onside. The Lions now He's got me in a snuggie fourth. right now. It's a Jameer oh, Gibbs touchdown. Goodness. Now to throw. Jameer, folks, it's intercepted. Picked by Derek Ford. We got to catch this, or I'm the biggest idiot alive. And the commanders are able to come Vaughn, in. you're the best. Okay. Run the ball, take three, get out of here. Like, if your mind is not telling you to get out of here right now, get out. Because you are starting to give this thing up. It's time to get out. It's time to leave. It's time to rethink your game plan. Because you're boxed. You're first down away. One cut. Yeah, that's good. Rumble, young man. Rumble. Good game, guys. Okay, I don't care how we got here, but we're four. This game was messy. I made one bad read. It's, it is what it is. For the most part, he played really well. Bond played really well. He did pick me twice, but at the end of the day, GG's to my opponent. Guys, we're back to four and three. We're over 500. Daniels is doing his thing. Isaiah Bond, you definitely can see he's doing his thing. Uh, we're going to take it one game at a time, and game one at a time, and we're going to win something here. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, week number eight. New dawn, new day, and we got another award, Ben. Um, he had two picks. He's got three interceptions in his last two games. He's somebody I, I'd love to see a breakout with, and I think part of me is a little bit disappointed um, that he hasn't got one. He's having his best year by far. I'm having a bit of a weaker year with Jeremy Chin. Last year at this point, I think I had 17 interceptions. Um... Little disappointed in those numbers, little disappointed in these numbers, not disappointed in this number. This is, when I draft him, I wanted that, but then Luke McCaffrey can't, these guys can't fall off because this guy gets better. That's kind of what I'm trying to process in my head. How do I, the problem is there's only so many receivers. You can't have three number one receivers. So if Bond starts playing like your number one, you can't have three of those. You can, like it's good if you do, but like you just can't. So I gotta figure out how to balance that. I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with that. Um, kind of as the season goes on. Jane Downs is not progressing as fast as I would like him. He's got a 12,000 XP bar because he's a little bit of an older guy. Um, but with that being said, he now gets Dashing Deadeye, which is awesome. So we got Dashing Deadeye spin cycle. 
and protect. He's starting to get those really good abilities and a couple of upgrades. He'll have his strong arm ability and he'll have set feet lead. So this is a big game against the Chargers. Um, we're 2-0 in our last two, so I don't want to overthink it. Hopefully they keep throwing at Ben and we can just keep picking them off and having fun. On the ground, here's the fourth round pick from April's draft. And he'll be out of bounds, but able to get it up past the four. Okay, expect a, a little bit of the run yards. game against people who well, run, which is me. Sometimes I do like to run the ball against big yeah, running big people. Run and a first down. It's important That's to what you commit everyone into play. early. That's excellent execution to get things started. So that doesn't get out of hand. Hey, if you stop someone's run, a couple of negatives, they make a good pass. When people are running he was brought down a lot, usually it means they're not great passers. I run a lot. You can take any one from that. But I know I got to commit a lot of people to stop this run early to try and just totally neutralize it. They'll try and run this one right up the Second round pick. Probably a big mistake at second round pick, but look at him. He's hype. He's loving life. He's happy. Shout out to Son McCullough. Not we'll the best user. Well, little slow in his hips. I still want to try and make it work. I just, I'm not convinced it will, but and maybe I need to just bit, commit. I'm to really categorize this crew. They're top 10 in the That's league nice against stuff. the pass, but the bottom half of the league in second. Now a handoff as they run left side. It's game tape or not watching it, but the attitude has to be what's done is done. Let's move on. Put that one behind them. Galvanize him going, or do you fake it to him and get out there? Teammate, right now the options are wide open. Second down and goal. Okay, that's good. Good secondary run defense. Well, secondary run defense. Like after the safety's gone, there was there was good help there. Jeremy, we haven't made a lot of big plays. We had two or three really big hits. No fumbles. Oh, there we go. He's good for those. Like, he'll again. hit you, and I've, I've thought about moving him back to safety line. and kind of just letting him no roam, but I don't want to risk losing his depth. That's the, the thing. Like, he's already gained this beautiful depth. I don't want him to lose it. They'll try to run this one in. And he's into the end zone. Touchdown. Here's Daniels. That's, that's called just being better. That is called just being better. Ooh. I had to, I probably, like, thinking about it, I shouldn't have thrown that ball. But I'm glad I did because like, we got a sick animation. But I, I probably shouldn't have thrown it. From the shotgun, it's Daniels. Working out of the gun, Daniels. This to McLaurin out on the left side. Yeah, and they get I to had a good amount of time there. I, just, to the I was looking downfield. I just didn't this see now a third and yeah. four. Throwing now is Daniels. That plays. That's my best play. It's caught. It's Are you seeing a trend? Zion. That, that's literally him on a streak in between zones. You bullet it in between those. And the Bond has been are within an extra point kind of, of crazy tying up this ball game. I hate to say it, but like he's kind of carrying me a bit. Seven. If this isn't the most painful offense I've ever seen, I don't know what is. Here's a give up it's the good. Middle. Like don't get me wrong, take this it's just like the 45 up to about the 46 the yard like line. Three yards on the pickup. It's up. every That's gonna down, set up an every interesting play, third and about four to go. Single chance he gets. He's running the ball, which is tacklers, especially closer you to can't the argue that it can be effective. But, but in this case, about the free like, safety. Ben <laughs> Sendo, that's five. Out wide and intercepted. He is on an absolute chance. Minimum. He should get a start at up for him. But even if he doesn't, if he continues at this clip at the end of the year, he's going to be a superstar. He'll be our first superstar cornerback on the team. What? He's seeing the ball so well and actually catching the ball when he has a chance. He's helping his team in a huge way. To throw is Daniels. And to the air goes Daniels. Work in the middle of the field, and he's got a man complete. And he goes down, but not before getting Isaiah his hands inside Bond, the 25. It's kind of the glue that's holding us together as a team right Daniels now. Daniels looking to throw. Oh my, Luke, that's a brutal yeah, route from Luke to the off the mark, too far out in front. That's a trust route from Luke. I put Luke on just a corner and like, man. 
for them to connect in the end zone. Absolutely bad. Yeah, Daniels. Eluding the pressure. Jack Daniels. Out of zone. Evading the blitz and getting beyond the line of scrimmage. I can't, man. Oh, the ball comes out. Oh my gosh, these all out blitzes just get so exhausting. They're tough, and I gotta get back to check that. Just lucky it wasn't a fumble, really. It was just bad. Hey, I'm go I'll, 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 I'd go for that again. I don't know why Luke McCaffrey in man is absolutely. I've never seen anyone get less open. And he got superstar blues. I felt like he got more open last year. Oh, that was, I was stubborn because I'm like, he's going to keep Luke leaving Luke one-on-one, -on -one, but he just did not. And we'll see these two teams to go to the lockers. Yeah. Yeah. Either side of the ball. Just go ahead and finish up the half and get on out and talk about it. Now it's Herbert. From the shotgun, here's Herbert. And that is the final shot before the break for Herbert. He'll air this one out deep for Davis. There's no way. And this is going to be intercepted. Oh, no, no, that was Ben St. Just. That was one-on-one. -on -one. I actually don't hate the read that he made right there. That was, if I knew that I was about to leave one-on-one -on -one in the Mossing situation, probably wouldn't have done what I did. So two quarters but down, it is what it is. two okay. remain. Charles and Seven I up, everybody. Um, after the break. I think we get ball at half. Just try and do better. The blitz is what's killing us right now. I can't seem to stop the blitz at all. Okay, I'm gonna, I got two people blocking. There's no way Looking he can throw. cover Bond here. Daniels going up top. No, he can't. That's the thing. If, you, if you're coming on that defense, you must be a blast drive, but like, we do have a burner on this team, so it's like, that's a great defense. It's cute. It was awesome. It worked against me for two drives. But eventually, I'm going to figure it out. He's having fun. He's actually having a really good game. 14 7. Oh, a good look in return set up here. He's past the 30. He might score. Oh, my he will score. On third down, he'll drop to throw. There we go. There we go, Luke. There we go. That's, 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 that's Luke McCaffrey. Perfect. Pocket, good read, good everything. Oh, and a massive first down when we needed it. They'll run for the first time. Back to throw. Daniels. Throw it again. He lets this throw it again. I think I threw it in the back end. of the end zone. And this is taken in He's for a Washington to touchdown. The end of the day, a great if you, you want to play the Game of Thrones, like, yards. you want to blitz, you want to play these tough, the cool defenses where you bring your safeties down. They kind of do mess me up and stop the run. You better have a deep safety, and he just doesn't have it. And Bond is having the game of his life. Daniels is having the best game of his season. It's all thanks to him and his stupidity. Good return up past the 30. They are sputtering right now. And frankly, I think it's time to call your playmakers together. No it's way, all right, guys. We're going to lean on you through this patch. We need you to get us like, back on just, track and get us going. It is big play, big play. He gets a kick return. J.K. Dobbins. Dobbins goes for the year. This is a battle going on right now. Are in Looking to throw. Daniels. And this throw incomplete. That's two for him. And that, and that is a, a superstar that time, DB, but... It's going to lead to third down. Oh, that goodness, that's two kind of weak for drops receiver. for him. Very is this tough just going to be a little spot on the ball? He ends up forcing the incompletion. Luke, yep. He's got his target. That's exactly. complete. And if it's overstoring, he's running defense like that. I got to be able to get the third. The deep ball may leave too much space in front of him. And these guys have been taking chargers able to get them. I don't even think backed off. That guy can cover barn. Out of the gun. Yeah, I don't think he can throw. make his barn. He's going to float this one deep right side. I think even backed That's off. The he's 20 yards backed off and he's and getting cooked. Bond, you deserve a payday because you are the only reason that I can beat this man on man coverage. So, straight ahead, it's Robinson. A solid stiff arm. Yeah, able to get him down, but he does reach. 
They'll run with Robinson. Wrapped up the runner for a loss. Get rid of it. Oh my god. And this is thrown to the sideline. No receiver in the area. That was bad because as soon as I snapped that ball, Bosa and Mac both got pressure on me. So it was like. Operating from the gun. Daniels. Take three. Take three and try and play defense. This for the lead in the final stages. And his kick is indeed good. Okay. We go up three. Defense. Ben, so Jeremy, like his last two touchdowns have been on the one. So maybe, just maybe, this is the drive that something cold. good can okay. happen. How many times you kick it into a net? You're not really ready when you go out there and all that beef is coming at you trying to block the kick. And a scrimmage. Now Herbert. Thanks, buddy. Thanks, buddy. Don't the door here on the way out. Gasson McCullough. Just as I roasted him. Not a minute after I said he wasn't a good user. That right there was worth the second round pick. One play was worth it. What a lurk. Six foot five. And then part of the reason we got that lurk is because he's six foot five. I don't think I'm going to be able to do that. found a way to make a play on that side of the ball. That one looks like he's a here. And he takes a shot out of the sticks. Yep, got him. Luke McCaffrey, have a day. That is how you run a route, kids. For all you kids watching at home, football players, watch Luke McCaffrey run that route. And then tell your coach to learn something today. That was a gorgeous route in a clutch situation. You can use that last time. Ladies and gentlemen, maybe our best offensive game of the year. As we didn't make a single mistake. This we threw for play. about 350. We had three touchdowns. Bond went crazy. Um, Luke went crazy. Terry had a couple of good catches. So and at the end of the day, we were going to throw GG to my opponent. Much respect. I can't come out I, of this. If I snap it, he's going to go offside. And uh, essentially, it stops the clock. So I'm not going to snap the ball. 26 seconds to kill. GG's. We'll talk about the stats um, after. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, coming off of what was absolutely a banger for Isaiah Bond. I'm starting to, like, underrate this guy now. Like, I, I feel like I was talking, like, pretty highly at the beginning. But now I'm like, am I not giving him enough credit? He's the number one receiver in the NFL after that game we just played. His, his devs glitched, and I don't know why. But look. 261 yards he just had in three touchdowns. That was maybe the most disgusting game ever. One, two, three, four games he's been over 100 yards this season. He's hit or miss, but he's the best deep threat target I've had all year. Luke McCaffrey is the one that, and I think I'm willing, like I might get on the phone. Not that I'm like, I want to. I don't want, don't get it twisted, okay? I don't want to get rid of Anybody. I really don't. But Terry McLaurin, if there was somebody I was going to move, I would listen. I'd have a conversation about Terry McLaurin. And I know it would make me feel bad. It would probably hurt my heart a little bit. But I'd have a conversation. I don't know. It's not it's not that I don't want him. I also just don't want him to drop a dead. And with Bond and McCaffrey kind of oh my chair just fell. Just pressed the wrong button. Oh, now my chair is really high. Uh, with Bond and McCaffrey kind of killing it, I look at this entire thing as like, though, that's the future. So where does McLaurin fit in when he's 30 years old? I don't know. This is a tough game against the Eagles. I think I just got to take it game by game. I, my record's not good enough, especially going to Kansas City next week. My record is not good enough to where I can be like, oh, let's trade McLaurin. We're so no, no, we need every single win we can get. Week 10, let's go. From the shotgun on third down, Daniel. It's a good play. Second That's a good play. A lot of pressure. The Eagles are notorious for just having pretty relentless. Yet another Alabama Operating from the gun, it's Daniels. Gets it away quickly. From the shotgun. It's yep. Daniel. Take the open guy. Ben Sinat. He isn't Sinat to be messed with. And they're gonna 
That's like I should have played him last. He's talented. He's he's pretty slick. Now Daniel throwing on first and ten. That's a nice throw. Yep, Bond. James. James. Perfect opening drive. Someone, do you ever just look at someone's opening drive and just think, wow, that guy's all got it all figured out? Is that what you guys just saw when you looked at my opening drive? That was smooth as silk. Perfect throw. Over and over again. Right to the air. It hurts. Open man downfield. He's got his tight end daughter. And they bring him down. Well, that's the worst user. I've ever seen. Operating from the gun, here's Hertz. That's caught. Saquon. They'll run with Barkley. He slams it. Win with speed. Good, accurate ball on the front shoulder. I think I got him again. Even even cover four, you can't. You can't stop bomb. Like that. FS zone blitz. If I see him parallel. Or even if I know he's gonna be parallel in like 10 to 15 feet, I know I can throw that ball. We are explosive and high power right now. Since the game where I got zero points, I've actually had an unbelievable offense. It just took me losing 28 nothing to figure some stuff. It took me hitting rock bottom to kind of slowly work my way out of rock bottom. That makes sense. This one taken at the seven. Oh, he's got room past the 30. A shotgun snap now to Hertz. On first and ten, it's Hertz. He's got the twelve. I'll run up the middle with Barkley. On first down, it's Hertz. Matt Jalen Hertz on second down. Oh, nice. Nice. Caught by the slot. A first down throw for Hertz. Oh. This one intercepted. Oh. Sorry, buddy. Sorry, little buddy. It looks like there was somebody there. That's two picks for him in back to back games. Maybe I start using him and try and get him to upgrade. I, I don't know. I'm kind of leaning towards that. Ryan, that's tough yards, kid. That is tough yards. Fresh set of downs. Keep this drive alive. Slide. Thank you. Whew! If someone's behind you, I actually don't know if sliding's the right move. Did you see? Like, I tried. I'm out there attempting to slide. Like, I, I am fully declaring myself ineligible. Yeah, beauty. Dashing dead eye. That's, that's gotta be 15 at the end. That's a really unnecessary hit on Bond right there. Daniel's now gonna look to throw. To throw is Daniels. That'll be caught by the Here's Daniel. I think I got him again. He'll take a shot here. You literally can't even run zone against us. <laughs> Ooh, that is the bond that's being formed between Daniels and Bond is beautiful, right? Bond is taking over this entire season. I love him. 21 7. On first down, it hurts. He's going to look for the. That is hard. And he. He's kind of a weird, kind of a weird beater, but. Boy, did that ever work. It works perfectly. From the shotgun, it hurts. That is Okay. Um, ma. Got a move still now. They'll throw with Daniel. Yep, Jaden just makes sure we're kind of. This is kind of breakpoint in the season, but I actually think about it. 
six and three versus five and four. This is break point. Like, if I win this, my stress levels probably aren't crazy high. I, I can, if I lose this and go to five and four, they're incredibly high from Brian Robinson. So this is by far the most important game of the year. And I think I knew that, but maybe I didn't. Maybe I didn't. I don't know. Jose Bond makes a move, too. On second down, it's Daniels. There's... He'll try and run for the first. I think the decision of... No chance. Okay. They're telling me apparently I didn't get that. You have a critical down, fourth down play that you know is going to work. Because if you do... I thought with at least the first kind of... No, I can't do this. He, he played the game. He knows He knows what's coming. He came out in goal line. I'm thinking I do this motion play and try and hit a slant over the middle or something with it. Like, that's... I don't hate that. Like, motion right, come back with a slant like his user should take a step his user should go one step that way go. Dot. good user nice user bud bye bye, -bye. good user on second down hurts he'll air it out down the i think butler has got that he does that's over the middle and intercepted that's the safety percy butler Good job. They'll start on the ground with Robinson. He's playing hard to stop the run. Out of the gun. It's he got it. From the shotgun on third down. And they will continue that was to go backwards. He's that was down for a second. Absolutely horrible. All the They'll indeed go. It's Daniel. It works as a punt. I'm glad he went for the pick. We were in trouble there. His that what that a gap blitz he was running was kind of cold. I won't lie. They'll drop to throw. He's gonna dial up another deep ball, and he's in. Okay, we got a game. Unfortunately, I think we got a game. Frick. This to a no game. Daniels to throw on second down. He got the first. Okay, that means clock running. Oh, that should be the win. Luke McCaffrey, you stud. He can get the ball back with however many time there's going to be after eight seconds. But I can even run backwards. I can punt. I think Luke McCaffrey just gave us a really good chance at this one. Yeah, use that little, use that little time out. Use it. They'll go again with Robinson. Now Daniels. That's gonna be dropped underneath. <laughs> GG, bro. Bye bye, Eagles. Bye bye. The double A gap was cute at the end. Four touchdowns, 300 for Jaden Downs, and what was a dominant performance when we needed him most. Isaiah Bond, number one target. Dude's a stud. GG's. Guys, it's not Christmas because it's only October. But Christmas is coming early. Nobody deserves it more than this guy. So I need, what, 70% completion and zero interceptions, minimum 30 attempts. Minimum 30 attempts with, what, what? That's just stupid. I'm just gonna throw a bunch of screens. I'm just gonna run, you know what? I'm just gonna run over and over jet touch pass. Those are automatic completions. I need 30 of them. So I think my run game is just gonna be jet touch pass. Clearly doesn't matter how many yards I get or touchdowns, it's literally a completion percentage is gonna decide. Wow. So completion percentage is about to decide my fate. Which is insane. Um, it's the dumbest game day goal I think I've ever seen. But it is what it is. Jeremy Chin, I think he finally is going to have a really, really relevant upgrade in about two seconds. Yeah, he is. 
These, I, I think if I were to use these in this league, it would glitch the entire league, so I'm not going to. Um, I can get mid zone, pick artist, and secure tackler. Yeah, that's what I want. So Jeremy Chin now finally has some relevant abilities. Um, this is a huge game. I got to go 70%, I guess, with 30 attempts. I don't know. Wish me luck. Hopefully this works. Yep, Luke McCaffrey. So that's what I meant by if I'm trying to spam completions and I need minimum 30. I don't know if I can get this. Like, I don't know if it's possible in... He's trying to get Third around down. the corner, but can't. Oh, okay. Third and long, and here's Daniels. Yep. Luke McCaffrey up top. This one is taken in. Good throw, man. But how do... How do I... How do I get 30... Throws here? Like, minimum 30 attempts? Are you kidding me? That's four. But, like, I definitely can't run the ball in this game. I can go jet sweep back to back to back. So like currently, if I did this two more times, I'm at six or seven. It wouldn't be impossible to get 30 attempts. I just have to spam this. And holy smokes, Luke McCaffrey. He's got room at the 30. And the ball you get bet. I love that. So this is what I have six passing attempts, and I'm moving the ball against the Kansas City Chiefs, which is just. That's just an added bonus at this point. And then you go to Terry McLaurin on this same run. Yep, good play. Throwing now, Daniel. Yep, Jane Daniels. See, that's thing. it doesn't matter that I did that because this is the weirdest QB breakout ever. But at the end of the day, if he doesn't go up to X Factor, I will live. I really want to beat the Chiefs. I really want to be seven and three, and I really want to have a successful season here. So that I will. I really just need to win this game. So let's lock in. We're up 7 0, and let's keep this going. Yep, thank you. Appreciate you, dude. That's Bynum. Hey, nobody cares about Bynum, right? It's just Bynum. He's slow. He's only 86 speed. Oh, awareness. Is he ever going to stat awareness? Third round pick. I think that was a steal. Steal, 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 steal. I love that. Yep. Good job, Luke. He's got five catches already. Throwing is Daniel. On first and ten, here's Daniel. Yep, Luke McCaffrey. I like these plays. I like the way this game's going. I'm getting every single drive. I'm going. Two jet touch passes, which is 100% completion every single time. And after I do those, essentially it's just like I gotta make one third down throw. Look at this. This might be my new steam because that thing somehow sucks. But when it doesn't, it's amazing. Throwing on second down, Daniel. He's gonna keep it himself. You are buzzing. Oh my, when things are working, like, that is a great example of things working like that. That was just the cleanest spin move I've ever seen. Mm, that's a nice throw. Here's Patrick, he'll throw it on first down. Ah, oh, nice play. Mahomes back. Thanks, good job. Third down. Throwing from the gun. Here's Patrick. So that's where by Adams. See, given to us, that play, Bottom's 86 speed maybe didn't help me, but sometimes it does. Oh yeah. You never want to lose yards on first down, but that's exactly the case here. That's okay. This is starting to look like what I maybe was expecting when I started this. The movement, every every aspect of this is starting to look a little bit more dangerous. With every game, they just look a bit better. They have to play their defense exactly according to the plan. 
Because if not, this quarterback has enough weapons, this receiver, and almost play him man to man. And it's exactly what they did here. And there was nowhere for the ball to go. And he's forced to just roll it. And the Lucas ball I love Luke. Down into the Luke and the cast for Reed. Have a day, man. And I knew his number would come. He's definitely. He's developed into our. He's our two here now, I would say. Yep. Oh, gosh. Okay, that's no longer a thing. Oh, my gosh. Go, go. One final. Okay, that old glitch where the time would just stop. In case you're wondering, it's gone. It's gone. It used to be that if you went and you went to the huddle and you came out, it would... They fixed it. Boy, oh boy, did they fix it. Shoot, they fixed it. I panicked there completely. That was one of the worst picks you'll ever see. But it is what it is. We're up 14 On first and 10, it's Mahomes. He's going to let this one go for Worthy. He's got it. And he's going to take this one oh, all the way. Okay. okay. 76 yards. Good play. Here is McClure. Oh, my gosh, McClure. And he'll be tackled up around the 45. I don't know what I'm at in terms of completions. It says I need 30 he'll for this X-Factor breakout. First and 10. I do think I can just bomb this to like, I think I've lulled him to sleep enough. I might be able to just the shotgun, throw that it's thing Daniel. up there. And I definitely can. That's Ja'Cory and Bennett, but he just can't. <laughs> Let's go, man. You can't even, even if you in cover three, you can't let up for a second. If you do, I can just lob it to Bond. As quickly as you relax, I'll lob it. in the red zone, and this is where you have to finish drives. Okay. That That's not working, man. Right? Third and goal. Third and goal. It's Daniel. And that is come out. I'll take my points. Continue to stress your protection over time like he did here. And to 70 and 14. We'll see what happens. From the shotgun. It's Mahomes. He's going to let this one. That's his first bad read. Oh. My God, this is the battle of fast Texas wide receivers. If you're a Texas football fan, oh my goodness, are you kidding me? This first down and goal. They'll run. Third and goal, Mahomes. You know what? Oh my. That was disgustingly good by him. That was disgustingly good. Now or never, they'll throw on fourth down. It's a box, fellas. Cannot believe he didn't get that touchdown. Honestly, I can't. This is one of those coaching decisions. He had that. Like he, he actually had the touchdown to Worthy. <sighs> Great defense. Okay. Now, I don't know where I'm at with the percentage play. It's a cool play, though. Working out of the gun, it's Daniel. Good play. How fast is how fast do you guys think that safety is up there? 34. They'll drop to throw. Yep, there it is. Who the heck in Ezekiel? He's got what, one time on the left. I did not mean to press this button, but that's game. There's no way he can stop us at this point. Guys, we just beat the Chiefs. Okay, question is though, how many completions am I at? How many completions am I at? Do I? No, he's. Don't quit. Don't you dare. No. I had 25. I'm not going to get it. He quit. I easily could have gotten. 
I was 22 for 25. Oh, that's going to be heartbreaking. That's going to be heartbreaking. I apologize. Great win. Couldn't be happier. It's just stupid. I was, I was five snaps away. I did everything I could. I was 88%. I did the Jets. I think that's just a really tough challenge. Um... But at the end of the day, we won, and his stats are still looking quite phenomenal. So, 20 touchdowns, 9 picks. I think everything's really... This season has really smoothed out a lot, which makes me really happy. So, I got a lot to be pumped about, even though it's not going to be Jaden Daniels, unfortunately. Oh my gosh. Ladies and gentlemen, it happened. I've been impressed. This is a breakout with Bynum. If I get one pick with Bynum in this game, he goes up. 100% we're going for this. Okay, one interception is all I need. Let's go. Okay, guys, this could be... The Daniels one obviously would have been huge. This could be everything. Like, if I could actually pull off what I wanted and Bynum becomes a superstar, that becomes a great trade. All I need is one interception with him. I think that's the goal. Seriously, it was one interception. So, going into this week, I lurk him once with Bynum. And, like, that's not an easy feat, but I'm going to use him the entire game. I'm going to make sure he's the one I'm running around with. I got a full game to get one lurk to unlock him to become a superstar. 27-year-old, 85 overall superstar, which would be crazy. Um, Luke gets an upgrade up to 84 overall. He's looking pretty good right now. We got the Eagles next week, a rematch that he's dying for. He was heated about that last game. Um, and I can't wait for it. Let's go. Eh, uh, agree to disagree, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Can you tell what? Yeah, you can. And it's intercepted on the first play of the game. And he's going to take this one. This defense I hate when I do that. I honestly, that's my least favorite way to go out. Like, I just don't now like a no further. I hate getting switch sticks picked. Week. Awake, it just feels for disrespectful. You can't totally shy away from throwing, but at the same time, you look and he okay. will score. Touchdown, Welcome. Las Vegas. Welcome to New York. Oh, some strong running, and all deep in his territory, he coughs up the football, and the Raiders pick it up. They're in an early hole. The first drive, they threw the interception. That led to a touchdown, so decent-sized... And he fumbled it. It's on the ground. And the Raiders pick it up. From the shotgun, it's Daniels. Caught out left side by Robinson. So the thing is, I don't think this guy's some this the brainiac. I don't think he's even Line smart. Well, no, he's probably he might be a smart 10. person. I'm not saying he's dumb, but he just I don't know. This just seems like it shouldn't Working be this. Gun, Daniels. Look at that. Stud. Good play. To throw is Daniels. That's out wide here for Robinson. Throwing now is Daniels. Flushed out right. All in all, that play as well. That defense closed on him quick and forced a quick surrender out of bounds. Good job. And he gets Good it job. down. Daniel's looking to throw. He'll Should have Bond there. Like I'm right saying, this guy isn't. This He's isn't Elon. I'm not. I don't want to say Elon. This isn't. I don't know. This isn't the greatest player ever. And gain any yardage. And he literally. I suck. Through the middle of the field. That was such a bad read. It was amazing. Such a horrible decision. It turned out amazing. Oh, that actually could have been beautiful. And all deep in his own territory. He caught some football. And it looks like the defense has got uh, it. And they take over today. already. Oh, I feel like talking. So problems compounding themselves it's here just, on the I think I gotta they focus on to trying to get a and lucky pick. The football. And then yeah, partner, things are starting to Try to focus on the Eagles next week. Front of our eyes. They're gonna be looking for some answers and quickly. He finds yeah. his man complete. It's How the heck have I I've Two fumbled like five times there. here? Now Minshew. And he'll find his man on the out route. That 
Now run straight ahead with Warren. And he fights his way in. Up, and they're still down double digits, so you feel like just to keep pace, this drive probably needs to end in the end zone as well. And I think the best move for them is to not worry about how far they are down. It's a good play by Terry. And see where this game is. Thargic out of sync, and it shows on the scoreboard. Get outside Holy smokes! Tackle. I I'm I'm and not quitting because I would like a pick with Bynum. Shape, but, but if you're back man, there in the pocket, man, you got to make sure of what you're doing. And he'll be hit as he when I lose in this it. franchise, I lose. Yeah. Daniel's gonna throw for it, eluding the pressure right. Now he's gonna throw deep right side, and this is caught inside the five. And he just falls short down at the one yard line. Such a good throw well, there. Hey, hate me if you want. I hate me this game halftime. completely. I hate me, but now that was gorgeous. Nice. Okay. Somehow we're not at out. Like, I don't think this guy's that good. I will stand on it. So I'm just going to keep throwing the ball. Deficit. I don't care anymore. I'm just going to keep throwing it. Looking to throw it, Minshew. Boom, good hit by him. Well, sort of, not really, but I'm like in the area where I could get a pick. I gotta just play, I can't do a really play down lurk. Like, I'm gonna lose this. I fumbled six times, but. Allen's got it complete. And taking it across. It'll be Minshew again. Give him another one right back to Allen. Out of the gun is Minshew. All the commanders are going to get there. He'll drop to throw. Over the middle complete. That's Warren. And now we'll He's going to take his points, which is fair. Do I get ball? I don't even think I get ball. Two. I think so I'm down 38 at half in a four-minute quarter game. It has to be a record. That's on target, but Not it's bad. no... From the gun, men shoot a throw. And that's throw left side complete. It just, it's that's hard to lurk somebody with 86 feet. Start digging in our second half blowout material. Escaping the pressure right. They finds his target out. <sighs> they'll set up a throw. Dodge the penalty. He'll look to throw. And he'll go right back to Allen. Man. That's complete. I'm and hoping for a pick. A not only for the breakout, just play. for the game. Even against double We're hurting, cover, man. Back to throw again. Flushed out right. Pass taken in by his big tight end. Again, Minshew looking to throw. Yep, Ben. Ben, can you give that pick? Can we pretend that was 28 instead of 25? Still love the Ben guy. That's six for him. Okay. Who knows? Maybe I'm still in. was a drive going, looking for the end zone. Possibly got a little bit too greedy right there. Oh, he'll take a shot from McCaffrey downfield. And coming. Here's Daniels. That's to McCaffrey complete. And he'll get... Working out of the gun, Daniels. That's caught. It's McCaff. To the air goes Daniels. There's a shot from the shotgun. It's Daniels. Now he's got McCaffrey open. Complete. To throw is Daniels. Eluding the pressure right. The ball comes out, but fortunately he's able to recover his own. That sums up the game. Could have been trouble. A lot of bad news on that the sums it up. A fumble, picking up my own fumble. Of I hope I get to play more defense. To I'm just going to keep trying to lurk with buying them. But them. Guys, this thing is hooked. Oh. And that's like fifth field. fumble of the day. It looks like this one of the deep at the 50-yard line. They go back to the air here after the INT on the last drive. Throwing a bench and get a chance to play. And a lot of coaches, they want to run their full playbook. No matter who's on the field. I don't think I'm getting a pick. And he's corralled, but not before. Here's Minshew. Got his man complete over I'm the middle. It's Warren. My best and chance is inside the down to about the Now it looks like he'll throw here. 
to break on the football when it's in the air. So fun to watch his closing speed and another example of it on that play. And yeah, that's going to be caught for a Raider touchdown. This is cut. Jacoby Shout out to the Raiders. I am going to honestly to just punt the ball back to the Steelers. Well, no, I won't punt. Extra point by Carlson up and this might be my 1,000, be my thousand IQ thing. I, I don't care about more offensive stats. I want Bynum's abilities. So I got to give him the ball send this one away. I'm going to see if he notices. And he's going to be. This one is getting close to being over, and they can try and hit the reset button starting tomorrow. That's caught left side by Simmons. Fighting through it, he's got space. And well, they go play action. Daniels. Quick hitter here, it's complete. Daniels looking to throw. Being chased out left. And he Off the play fake. Daniels. And he'll go down here right around the 23-yard line. Good game, guys. Good game. And as this good game walks off the for field, Nolan. They can do not so even, with their no, heads not a good game. High. I only threw one pick, but it's my offense too. I mean, really, Charles, just this is a complete wild thing domination this on both Two sides of the Danny. football here in this one. Certainly was, and I think both and then, sides compete sure against each other all the time. Times. You go to each other in practice, obviously you're training I don't think camps, any, you're off season. I don't think any human has ever day, fumbled more than I just You both want to show your best. Unless yeah. Bynum glitched out the game, we will not be a superstar, and we got to go play a really tough Philadelphia team coming up. Hey, it's these seasons, man. They're going to be ups and downs. It's the NFL. It's tough. I love Isaiah Bond, though. He's a beast. That was a dumpster fire. I hate to say it. That was a dumpster fire. Did I get it? <sighs> I can't get breakouts. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, a rematch. A beautiful rematch against the uh, the sixties here. Now, I think I gotta have a kind of a short memory where it's like, oh. Yeah, no, I just got completely embarrassed. But I can't really let it get to me too much. Yeah, I did get embarrassed. Yeah, it was horrible. But it is what it is. I'm just dealing with it, taking it play by play. Cameron Bynum still gets an upgrade. Uh, he got 2,500 XP. That was my chance to get him a superstar. I used him the entire game. I promise you I did everything I could. It's just everything I could wasn't enough. Um, it just wasn't enough. Eagles really started playing good against us. As that game went on, it just got tougher and tougher. So my plan here is quite simple. Um, I gotta run the ball because he was dotting me up and he was playing really good football. So we're gonna run the ball a little bit. We're gonna try and play this a little differently than I, I normally would. Um, and we're just gonna cross our fingers. We can get a dub. I just got sacked trying to hand the ball off. What a bunch of garbage from these super nerds here. They'll throw with Daniel. Yet another Alabama back in the league. This working out of the gun, it's Daniel. He'll let it go deep left side. Yep. Here's Robinson. And a strong ball for it. Second run. run. Another run here for Robinson. A drive, and he's in. <laughs> Brian Robinson. That's why we run the ball, folks. Ladies and gentlemen, that is why we run the rock as much as we do. To calm things down. Your season's a little bit in the balance. You struggled. You run like that. It just it's the easiest way to score a touchdown and you're up seven up. To the air right away is Hurts. Open from the shotgun. It's Hurts. That's caught. Saquon Clark. A shotgun snap now to Hurts. Good job. From the shotgun, it's Daniel. 
Ben Sinat. Ben Sinat. Oh man, Cooper to John, nice play. That's so good. So good. Yeah, quit. Quit. Quit if you want. I won't miss you. Just quit. Yep. And now the next step is can they come away with six? Because anything less than that. Yes. Luke. They'll run with Robinson. And one more time, it's Robinson. They'll still gonna run. run with Robinson. Still gonna run. I just trust that one. Still gonna run. 14 nothing. Let's go. Great from the worst. Half of football to the best. Pretty quick. Throwing is Hurts. Escaping the danger. Yep. <laughs> Keep on running forward, buddy. You're just going to run out of time. Love it. A second down throw for Hurts. He'll take a shot here. Back of the end zone. To the air again. Hurts. Got a man, man, he's got it. And he's that was wide open. Force the run and keep this to no gain. Man, that makes a big difference on any defense. He's gonna tuck it and go. Just okay, that was actually okay. I know this guy's pretty good. I do. His defense, what it needs to be, has been pretty solid. On third down, they'll throw with Daniel. Yep. First down. Good job. Now Robinson. Now Daniels. On target. Got it to Mc. They'll run with Robinson. And he'll take this. Good job. Second down. They'll go again with Robinson. And he'll get this down to the 40th. First down. I am going to run out the clock because I need this win. Very, very, very badly. And I like beating this guy. And his defense is pretty good. So that is why we are going to be making the decision to run the ball and kill clock. <laughs> Woo! That is gorgeous. Brian, your spin move is underrated. You're an Touchdown underrated running back, team. Brian Robinson Jr. Don't let anyone tell you this differently. You're very game. underrated. And from the six. He's to midfield. I just. Inside the 20. <laughs> They'll drop to throw. And that is. Then you got it. You went for two. Okay, we're getting an onside kick Five here. No, we were going to kick off. Seven. Okay. Find a way. No more kickoffs. Find a way. Into your favor. That should be GG, boys. He's got one timeout, I think. So this guy doesn't have to leave. In Philadelphia, you guys know they're known for their cheesesteak. This guy actually, he doesn't own a cheesesteak place, but he owns a cheese factory where he actually supplies a lot of the cheese. He's shipping more his product to businesses. He doesn't go directly to the consumer, so you can't actually buy his cheese. But if you go to a lot of places in Philly, they're using the cheese made at this guy's cheese factory. Um, and that cheese factory opens in six minutes. And it's 1247, That's yeah, it opens at 103. So he's gotta go, he's gotta start making the cheese. He doesn't actually make it anymore, he's more of 
need more management, but okay, we'll see you guys next week. Guys, it is like at some point, I'm gonna get one. Like you just, oh, I can't do this anymore. I have to get one. What's another goal I could pick? Four tackles. Okay, I'm gonna go with that. The one that I'm really excited for is the one that we're about to find out about. And I, I've been waiting for this one for ever because I feel like he's an unreal player, but he's not like, I'm trying to think of how to put this. Okay. This is the best one. 100 rushing yards and a touchdown. So I need 100 rushing yards with Brian Robinson Jr. I will do whatever it takes. If I can get that, things are going... I got the leading receiver in James Bond. Okay. Luke's having another good year. If I could get Brian Robinson up to superstar. He, he looks... He, that's going to be different. Things are going to look different. Okay, lock in. Let's do it. Good job, Brian. Nice Second three. Good 100 run. yards and a touchdown. So, we're in a position right now where I'm probably making the playoffs. Let, let's be real about everything. I think I can make it. However, that's not guaranteed and that's not decided. And the problem is, I have to find a way to get 100 rushing yards. With him. Daniels throwing on third. He puts some air under this one deep right. That's cut at the 25. Get him his touchdown. I, just, I want to try and get him his touchdown first. I want that out the way. I don't want that to be. I don't want that to be a stress down the road. I love Jaden. I love Bond, but like, this is about the team. It's about the future. I know getting everyone to superstar is very important. Oh my God. On the gun, it's Daniels. Buys time, rolling right. Okay, it's seven up. Good job, Daniels. Uh, zero yards with Brian Robinson Jr. It just seems like this is my life now. I just don't. I'm Brett. Hi. I'm Brett, and I don't get breakouts. You can't spell breakout without Brett. Right down the no, middle. No, you can't it's spell going. no. I don't know. Seven zip. This game starting with some serious haymakers. Dump off to his fullback. Good hit, man. But not really. Take that shot. It's taken in by Roman Dunze. And he's going to score. Mm. To third and seven. He's going to try to drop it in. Bond is the best. Deep threat I've had all year. We're going for this. Yeah. Luke. Luke. On the gun, it's Robinson. That's a good play. Six rushes, 17 yards. That's a good play. That's our best run of this entire thing. Going to the ground again on first. Fine. Thanks to a great effort defensively. Yeah, I don't know, man. We might, we might not be running to a break. I, I would do anything for it. Like, I truly want it so bad. You have to run on, like, third and these, these crazy down. That's when I'm going to get it. It's going to be, like, third and longs. I have to run on third and long and really just try and mess with them. Snap to Daniels. And that is caught. It's a Washington touchdown. 
the commanders oh. take the lead just good play 14 7 we're moving it i just want the breakout man that's exactly what the secondary did and it forces the throw away okay i have one second okay he, this is our best chance for some free yards he's back that pick could have been our hey i'll take nine yards what is that like i'm at like 40 yards happy with it that's gonna be taken in at the eight find some space he's past the 30. i don't know if they're gonna it's i i'm honestly i'm done kicking i'm i think i'm done kicking i'm just gonna onside kick every time I'm the worst kick return guy in the world. They begin here first and goal. Swift. Off the play fake, Williams. And oh, someone stepped in. It's intercepted. Mike Sandler still makes the play. That's actually, that's a three-point lead. That's a three-point lead. That was sick. Make this a clip. That is. Did you see that? Can we timestamp that, please, for me? So I can watch it later. That was sick. Luke. Have a day, Luke. If you don't convert a good portion of your third downs, it's a money down. And nice to see the more of the dice. Second and 15. That one. Throwing now, Daniels. Oh, that's a miss. That's a miss, that's a miss, that's a miss. Looking to throw. Six catches, 106. Luke McCaffrey. Should have been his breakout. But yeah, I don't think I'm going to get the breakout, unfortunately, guys. I've tried. I've ran, I think, 15 times. It's just at some point, it just looks like that the game's just not going that way. This is Robinson. Luke Green, they'll welcome the reinforcements every time. Force that to his right. And that is caught. It's a Washington touchdown. Luke's unguardable for that. The pistol, Williams. Trying for the deep ball. It's a brutal throw. It's intercepted. Sit right here. Emmanuel Forbes makes the play. Hope he doesn't quit. And then we're just gonna try and continue to run the ball. That's gonna be our goal. Run the rock. Robinson on the inside give. Going right side. Robinson with it. Well for like him, the yeah, there's... I'm doing my best. There comes a point where you don't really want to disrespect your opponent. Like, this just feels like I'm stat farming. Because I'm stat farming. So like, I just don't think it's going to happen. But hey, on the off chance this fourth and one goes for 80 yards, this, to me, this entire thing would be worth it. He'd be a superstar for the next three seasons. So. Oh my gosh. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, he needs a touchdown now. Oh, gosh, he needs a touchdown now. Guys, that's the clutchest. How many breakouts have I failed? That's the best clutch breakout scene you'll see this week, I promise you. Future superstar Brian Robinson. Guys, we didn't get Jeremy Chin, but I think that last run was enough. After I ran... 50 times. That's huge for him. Because I, I've never felt like he was amazing in the game. I feel like he's better in real life. But like now... Now dude's not bad. He really isn't. Like I think I can get... I can get spin cycle. I can get tank. Like I technically can get... Back to recovery or a team where they're for momentum. I, I those break the game because this league was created before. I can get spin cycle and tank on him. That just changed the entirety of the franchise. I promise you, 
the playoff strategy, everything, that just helped me out a ton. What? I was done, I was... What? 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 How? How? I didn't even think I got to tackle with him. Guys, we just left this week with an X Factor and a new superstar. We're buzzing. Guys, I am beyond excited for Spin Cycling, Spin Dude Brian Robinson. Like, this to me is beautiful. Beautiful. Like, I can spin people with 80. Like, this guy, I'm wondering if he hits the threshold like Derrick Henry does, where his spins are super OP. And if he does, I just can't wait to see it. And Jeremy Chin is the next factor. There's a lot of good things to talk about. Let's just go beat the Saints. Back to throw now on first down. Wide open receiver complete. Look at the big man rumble. And he'll take it in okay. the end zone for the Saints. Okay, I want to see what spin cycle looks like. Run for the first time it's fast. And the no, that's fast. That's, that is really fast. That is as they stop him behind the really line. Fast. They'll run again here with Robinson. And once oh, more, play. Play. Third down. Working out of the gun, Daniels. Yep. He's going to wind up and air back down. fade it. If, if, if you got Jordan for it, then it's like, hey. If no one sells to you, but I'm going to insult you and say you should come out there. No one sells to you. No disrespect, but and the commanders are able to They're gonna look to throw. Got this complete to Jahan Dotson. Oh, good play. Riley Leonard, shout out to Notre Dame, man. Shout out to Notre Dame. They'll look to throw here on first half. And he takes a shot. Jeremy Chin. This will be incomplete. This is kind of a glitchy now play. Second. He'll drop to throw. Hmm. This pass hauled in by Dotson. And he's going to get oh, this one gosh. down to the end. And they'll run it here. He'll, he'll look to throw. And he's got him. It's a one score deficit, 14 7 as they come up first and ten. That, okay, his spin is really good show of force there as he gets his spins really quick. Um, so well, I was thinking that this might be our ticket to the Super six. Bowl. Robinson with another carry. Like with Derrick Henry, his spin is quick and, and not over. Robinson will try to pick it up. And yep. he's got it to the roots and powered forward and got the first down. Straight ahead, it's Robinson. Pick up the first. Daniels from the gun on third down. Throws to his man. That's unreal. Round. It's complete. That's Robinson. And that was a quick little completion. Got the job done for a first down. This one hauled in, and again, it's Robinson. Okay, never mind. He's amazing. His tank ability is the one maybe that's more important than in the running game on this drive. Now he gets a I was initially thinking spin side the, the power abilities I get with him. I think that's that's on me. In the NFL. As a human, I think I was looking at this the wrong way. Equal proficiency. And this one in to throw is Daniels. Work in the middle of the field, and he's got a man complete. And this is going to from the shotgun. It's Daniels. And this is taken in for a Washington touchdown. Just go ahead and finish up the half and get on out and talk about it. He's going to look deep down the field. A wide open, complete. Now he breaks free in the middle of the field. Touch. To the air goes Daniels. He's going to float this over the middle, deep. Oh, that's in the double coverage and intercepted. And the Saints will take over here just shy of the 30. Tough one there. First it. drive of the third I've thrown that ball a lot this season. A chance that they could be it was a little a bit too in the air. It was points. too long. Yeah, how good do you think? And they'll go with a ground attack here. Uh -huh. And he is... Second and 14. Firing quickly okay. here, and that's complete. Okay. They get 11 okay. back on that. On third and short, they'll try and pick it up through the air. Pass taken. 
On first down, he'll drop to throw. He's going to launch this thing way downfield. That's a pick. And that's that a is pick. it. Again, he'll drop to throw. Flush to his right. Yes. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. And that's caught inside the 30. And he makes it. All. They'll look to throw again. And a quick throw here. That's I need to stop. And he'll take He's it still throwing the, the ball. But no, this, this guy just outplayed me. Flat out. He outplayed me. And they'll go on the ground. And now back to throw. And That's just bad using. Like honestly, if you use it like that, was, that was horrible using throw it on this. Partner, how do they recalibrate and get this proverbial train back on track? Well, this is where leadership really comes into play. Yeah, it's been sucks. It right. Throw it out the window. Yeah, let's get back on track here. And sometimes that'll work just fine. I guess it's time now to lean on that leadership. Now Daniels. Throw left side. Throwing now is Daniels. And this I don't is know. caught now for a late oh, touchdown. So hold everything here. This one's not over yet. I really do. Please, what is right up here. with the kick meter in this game? Good kick. The Saints Good try. I felt like I had to do something. Do um, we'll try and blitz the run. We're, we're most likely lost this game, but I'm, I'm proud of that drive that, so that I just had. Got to be aggressive and find a way you to never know. The ball. They can't just rely, as you noted, on using their timeouts and getting the ball back. They might not have any time to mount an attack, even if they the do play it that way. And he is in yeah, the end zone. Pretty good for me. Now I have another shot. Orleans. These guys know where they stand in relationship to yardage, totals, numbers, the whole deal. And let's face it, all of them, they it's caught inside the 25. If I get another chance at an onside kick, I'm not, I'm not mad. Still in 10. Daniel's looking to throw. Dancing to his left. You know what? I can do it. And that should do it. Picked off by Marshawn Lattimore. Okay, good game. We'll bounce back. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are in week 18. We had a force win against Seattle. Um, this is the final game of the season. These are my stats as of right now. 33 touchdowns to 13 picks. Holy smokes. Ladies and gentlemen, sit back in your seats. Enjoy the show. Just take this all in. Timing could not be better. Um, Jaden Daniels is officially going to have some sick abilities. So I can get past lead elite with him. I could get hot route master, I should. I need to take away spin cycle anyways. Spin cycle's gotta go. Hot route master could be helpful. I'm leaning towards protected, past lead elite. I'm leaning towards those kind of being my Jaden Daniels abilities. But let, let's do let's do a side by side. You could argue this season was better, but you could argue it was similar. It wasn't great, but other people were much better this season. That's I think 1400 yards with Bond, Luke McCaffrey going for a thousand again. Ben St. Juice should go up. Like that dude is due for something. Two good years in a row. Chin has a horrible year, and I, I'm I'm more shocked than anybody by the fact that Chin had a horrible year. Nobody, I had 16 picks with this guy a year ago, and now I'm just, oh, bleh. But okay, I want to end the season on a positive. I just want to beat Seattle, prepare for the playoffs, take it one game at a time. Let's get it. Drive begins with a run. It's Robinson. Heads up. Okay, one play at a time, folks. This is one of those plays that we take it one play at a time. Cake, we I have fun. We play football. I'm currently stuck in my own blanket. This could be his run. I got a long word called chill. I have to chill. I don't know why I'm always trying to run people over. Just take your yards, Brett. Sometimes I do stuff and I'm like, man, oh man, I'm such a meathead. This is the time when I felt that way. Oh, that's a lot of yards. Get him. I, I want you to hit a thousand, man. Nobody wants you to hit a thousand. Oh! You gotta clip it. 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 
That is. Couldn't have been more open. Completely horrible coverage. Here's Brees Hall on the ground for the first time. Big gap up the middle. Is in for the New York. On second and ten now. Daniels. Chased out to his right. And he's going to go down. From the gun, it's Daniels. This is hauled in by the Terry. You might have to really click this. this read or not. No, he actually, he actually dropped everyone back. And this is why no matter what, I have no, even though his targets are down, most of the reason his targets are down is just because we have two super elite receivers. And he's super elite too, but we have two young super elite receivers that I just feel like I need to be putting my time into getting them the ball for the future. But I think this is, this is going to be quite deep. I think sometimes we worry too much about the future and not enough about the present. And that's kind of how I feel. Yeah, I knew he was going to leave that and play the quarter out. Yep, Bond. Bond is gone. That's where he's a bit of a Tyree tail. Like, he catches it. You make one guy miss, there's not a single person on the other team that's going to be able to catch him. So you're gone. You're immediately just... It's a touchdown. That's great. I think, that, I think we're, we're due for a new edge rusher, realistically. I could have had Jalen Walker, but instead I got a 6'5 linebacker. Good play. Need a conversion. That's going for it. Finds a seam down the middle. The nice game is met by a punishing hit to bring it to a halt. That, my friends, is my ball. First and ten now. Here's Daniels. He's on the move. Yep, he left him. He left. Switch stick gone wrong, fellas. That, my friends, is a switch stick gone wrong. People try and card clear up. Always wait, because when people switch stick, and it gets me sometimes, but wait, because they'll literally pull defenders out of deep zones to play a corner row. And then all you do is just you throw. Okay. Holy, he is... He is absolutely getting just... I'm going to call a timeout. Because I can. Bro, why are you calling a timeout? Isn't that a little bit disrespectful to your opponent? No, it's only 21 7, and I want more points. So I'm going to call a timeout. So let's turn to a fan favorite. It's Thomas Morstead to punt it away. Takes it in at the 26. Shotgun snap to Daniels. We'll get it now Daniels off the play action. Looking to throw. I don't know why I'm not. Sorry. I'll only make good decisions with that. I don't know why I went for that one. That was, that was, I was really embarrassed by that. Jamin Davis? Jamin, can we just say Jamin Davis? That was unbelievable. That's a strip sack fumble. You don't see those. Well, Those aren't crazy comments. Can make you awfully happy as an offense player, especially when you screw it up in your fumble. And then, the okay, we're ready. We're ready. For the I do. I wouldn't want to play us. I know we're not perfect. But I don't think I'd want to play. Us. Another throw coming on second and ten. Caught nice gain left side. It's a good hit attempt. Still sticking with the passing game. Completed over the middle. From the red zone now. Up. Incompletion. Give on second to Hall. Good job, Alan. I know you can feel it from the jump, and that call from the defense, that came at the perfect time. Four steps to his right. I think I fooled him, and I did. And I was trying to do this Touchdown run backwards, one. run up, pick Jets thing with the cool animation. Everyone smiled, we all happy. Garrett, That's what I was trying to do. Second down and ten. Daniels. He finds his running back. Nice work complete. Good job, Brian. 
191, three touchdowns. Hey, the nice thing is Daniels is going to end his regular season with a really good outing here uh, against a pretty good team, and hopefully that lets us go into the playoffs. Freaking A, Reddick. Another try following the sack. On the gun, it's Daniels. On the move, headed right. Here's Daniels. That one's cut along the left sideline. They are throwing it again. Completes one to Ben Sinnott. Ben is not messing around. He's to not messing around. Okay, get seven here. This guy's going to quit. And then we got GG's in the chat. Then four games and Daniel's holding the trophy. Yep. Ben Sinat. GG, bro. Four touchdowns. This guy's got to leave. I'm not going to make up an excuse for him. Like, no, I'm not. But he is a doctor and he has a surgery. that He's, he's performing knee surgery on a patient. It's 303 and that surgery starts in two minutes. That's why I'm not making excuses. He just has to leave. He's, he's not quitting. Guys, there's no time quite like it. There's nothing more important than it. It is officially... Playoff time. We finished the year with 37 touchdowns, 13 picks, 600 on the ground. Bond went crazy. Luke McCaffrey went crazy. Six sacks with Davis. Ben St. Juiced. Jaden Daniels, 37 touchdowns to 13 picks. Unbelievable performances from a lot of players. From a lot of players. We didn't win any major awards except one uh, offensive player of the year with Isaiah Bond. And... He also won offensive rookie of the year. I would say you can pretty much bet everything you own that um, Bond's going up to superstar next year. I can promise you that. That thing, I think I could probably put that in writing. Bond will be a superstar next season. Now, going into this, I got upgrades. I have two upgrades for Isaiah Bond. And I'm going up against the Rams. I don't want to overthink this. My game plan for the playoffs this year is literally just run. Don't let myself make dumb decisions. Make people stop me in the run game first. If they stop me in the run game, well then I figure out everything else out. But like, I wanna see that people can stop me running before I do anything else. And that's just how I kind of feel about the season. That's my plan. I feel like Brian Robinson Jr. is a really good running back. So it's important to me that I go out and I establish that part of the game early. This guy's ready to play. It's the Rams. It's the playoffs. Let's go. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, one play at a time. As, as I kind of mentioned, my game plan is very simple. Until Brian Robinson Jr. fails me, I don't want to fail Brian Robinson Jr. If that makes any sense to you. I want him to be the guy. I want him to get a lot of the, the kind of the main carries here at the beginning. And then if they stop him, I know it's not the fact that I can't pass. I want to make sure that I show him this aspect of the game. And don't just give up on And right now you can see he's got three rushes to 42 yards. I said when he became a superstar that it would have the biggest impact, not necessarily right now, but in the playoffs. And I think that's a little bit obvious right now. Here's the first carry for Like the run game is killing this guy's dollar defense. I'm just going to keep on running. Robinson up the middle. And... Back to Robinson now on first down. And this is the most boring drive you've probably seen this week. It's the most boring drive I've ever seen in my entire life. Robinson, but he'll try the left side. Hopefully it's Gets effective. And he's rumbling and stumbling and bumbling and he's first contact, but I haven't even stop shy of the, the thought line. of throwing the ball hasn't even crossed my mind yet. For... Daniel's gonna try he's to got sneak. It. And he's going to be touched Good job, buddy. at the line of scrimmage. Like, I truly We're went this entire drive without even thinking about throwing the ball. And that's called being scared, is one word that people use. So Sometimes you'll hear people say the word scared. For our first points There's in other words that you can game. use. Robinson. 
That's the best running back in the league. Can we clip that, please? Oh my gosh. Can we please clip that? Let's go. Seven nothing. He just broke three times. Stafford now to throw. Oh my gosh. He's throwing, He's throwing the ball at Ben. Here's Stafford. To the air again, Stafford. He's got his run out of the backfield. Oh, that's a good decision. They'll fake the give. Now Stafford. Escaping the pressure right. <sighs> and he's got his big tight end here. Off of play action. Here's Stafford. Unfortunately for him, the coverage downfield, equally good. That's great defense from Shin. Don't let anyone run back. Don't let it. No, that's. Yep. Good defense. Third and ten. Good defense, good defense, good defense. Again, it's Stafford. Stafford. And now a first chance for the backup here to throw. Being chased out left. And he'll be goal. They're going to look to throw. They'll buy some time right. And he'll be brought down right on the edge of the goal line at about the one yard line. Yeah, it is. This is what, this is what playoffs gonna are going to come down to. It's plays like this. It's moments like this. This is what it comes half. down to. Looking to throw. Flushed out right. And he's brought down. Catch. Oh. And we'll see how this is played. Offensively, they've got the lead. Not the a inside. lot of time left. Well, what do you think, Gerald? Gerald sort of thing? Yeah, That's he is. And this will be caught at the 30. So, and he's taking I want, I want to see if he uses his timeouts. Hey, we're in the playoffs. There's no friends There's no friends. I'm completely comfortable taking this to 12 seconds and living with three if, if it's now, three. Washington I just don't want to give him time. He still had two timeouts. timeouts. One play, he gets the field goal right back. This way, no matter what. like I do whatever I can to guarantee a two-score lead at the corner. So To the air goes Daniels. And that's going to be a four touch much in this game although they do trail what's the game plan charles for the second yeah 25 yard or uh, i had a 25 or maybe i had a 25 on the other side i think i had one on the other side now a play fake it at stafford throws right side and that's complete what on earth is happening and he'll get it I'm very a confused with adjustment. I just, are my zones locked out or something? Okay, definitely don't want to be doing that in the playoffs. My zones must be completely out of whack. I have, don't even know how that just happened. On the previous possession, and even though they have that lead, it feels like a back and forth ball game. Mm, yeah, this just game, this game just got a lot more interesting. Maybe they need at least really three quick. here on their team. So what you want to do now is have your own drive and try and make sure that that momentum stays in your camp. Working out of the gun, Daniels. Looking for McLaurin, and he's got him. Throwing now is Daniels. Flush to his right. No, don't take a risk. That was. It's just a game I'm really glad at my decision down. there because there was, was there was a moment by a blitz on where I definitely down, could have thrown that ball. Catch him in Robinson will try to pick it up. And he gets this one so good, so good, so good, so good. Okay, Brian Robinson Jr., just take us home. This isn't the... We need three more. Take us home. They'll run again here with Robinson. And they're going to stop into the backfield, but he wasn't able to get him down. But his compatriots, they were able to grab him at the line of scrimmage and not let him get any further downfield. A give left side to Robinson. And he takes it in. Touchdown, Kevin. Brian Ryan. It's going to be Jr. kind of like that in the playoffs. He's going to be the guy. And I know everyone else is flashy. There's, there's the a lot of talent here. But in the playoffs, throwing the ball is really nice. It really is. Okay, it looks like our peer has quit the game. I don't know if he quit. I'll have to ask. Um, but if he's officially quit, 
Like if he lost connection, we'll reset. If he quit, we just win. Okay, so ladies and gentlemen, he did DC, but he said he didn't feel like we needed to be recruited. He felt like it was over, which means, guys, we get the win. Brian Robinson Jr. was absolutely unbelievable in that game. Uh, and going into this next week against the Panthers, the divisional, I'm looking for the same type of performance. I'm looking for the same smoothness. Now, this is a team that has a lot of studs. They have Travis Hunter. They have Bryce Young. All these guys. This, this is the squad. Um, and... I know in order to beat them, this is a very, also a very good player, that I can't be stupid. I think that last game, I didn't make any crazy mistakes, but I also didn't play amazing. So, like, I know I got to be better. I know I got to lock in a little bit more. And I know the goal is the Super Bowl. So, <laughs> at the end of the day, find a way to win, be great, and let's go. Drive begins with a run. It's Robinson. That's the baddest dude doing it right now. That's the baddest dude doing it. And this isn't flashy gameplay anymore. This is very toned down version. And kind of making up for some of the mistakes I made last year. Last year, if you saw me, I was a much different player. I was very aggressive. Um, to where it wasn't good. It, it got ugly. Now this is me just being a little bit more. You know what? I know who I am. I know who we are. Let's just play football. And that's that's how I feel right now. Like, look look at this dude. Look at him. Just run. Why overthink when you can run? Beautiful. Beautiful execution to start this game. And I've taken zero risks. There's nothing that I've done so far that would be even remotely considered to be a risky play. It's just yards. Four rushes for two yards. Shotgun snap to Daniels. Into the hands of Terry McLaurin. And he's in for the Washington touchdown. The Commanders take a 6 0 7 zip. Laser. Okay, that was elegant. That's a good word, isn't it? Elegant. That was a really elegant drop. Out of the gun, Young. He's on the move. Now here he goes. Okay, you don't really know what the heck he's doing. I would like to just make that abundantly clear. He knows what the heck he is doing, this guy. And I don't like it. Mm, go five. Buys time, rolling right. And he will score. It's a Carolina touchdown. That's a good play. The Panthers finish up oh, no hate run. in my heart on that. That's a dot. A good job. Okay. Touchdown. Seven up, folks. Running left is Robinson. I'm just going to keep on running. I, I want to control the tempo of this game. Especially, like, more after seeing his offense. There's sometimes that I'll change a game plan. When I see someone with a really good offense, I want to see their offense as little as possible. I want to see their defense. So, you're better off. Like, you're going to see me run a lot more when I'm playing someone with a good offense than with a bad. If someone's bad on offense, I'm going for one play touchdowns because I want him to mess up. Like, you'll see me start trying to throw bombs when I think someone's bad on offense because then the game changes. Then he's going to throw a pick. If someone has a bad offense and you have long, methodical, good drives, even if you score, you're not taking advantage of the biggest weakness potentially that you have on their team, if that makes sense. Yeah, that's a dot. That's a dot. Let's go. Luke McCaffrey, crazy. We're just, we're kind of surgical right now. I'm just saying, I feel really calm in this playoffs. Like, look at my energy. Calming energy, even my voice. We're, just, we're calm. We're playing very, very, very calm. Good job, Dijon. Left side. Here's Thank Robinson. you, Juan Smith, for he does. <laughs> See, that's how you know he's good on offense, and I shouldn't play like this. But I, I know you guys want to on the podium. I'm going to do what I can. But... Okay. 
Fourteen seven. Okay. Let's go. Good flex. A second down throw for y'all. On the move, hit it right. That would have been pi. I was trying to connect. I did you see me? Like I was. I had my finger on hit stick and I was ready. That's great. That's it. I need you to go though. I need you to go. Did he, did he take care of the time off the clock? He had one time well, no, out, I which I know is a lame Parker, thing to do, but then he had to play that drive. You saw his first drive. Really he didn't miss a read. He had a perfect, like that. Yeah, perfect drive that first one. On first down, here's Daniels. We'll get it complete. Out of the gun, Daniels. Escapes the pocket. And he just hucks. Here's Daniels. He switched it, but he's not quick enough. He had the right idea. He had the right idea. <laughs> oh, let's go. 21-7. Good throw. Here he is on third and long. He's on the move. Nope. Fuck bag. Fourth down. And going for it. Young. Chased out to his right. I'm there. He's got it deep down field. You gotta be kidding me. Thank you. Thank you, please. And this is gonna be a turnover the We got a little bit of fight, fellas. This playoffs is going. Slick, 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 slick. slick. Good job, 21-7. Throwing now, Daniels. Buys time, rolling right. That's that's calm. Classy. First. Run the ball, be smart. Going right side, Robinson with it. And it hand off now to Robinson. Back to throw. Here's Daniels. Diving right side. That's so beautiful. That's so so beautiful. Okay, I'm not trying to say these games, but like this is some of the better Madden I've played all year against two guys who've beaten me multiple times. Playing really good. On the give, here's Robinson. And he a run here with Robinson. Look at this dude spin. And that's good spin cycles been huge. That was the biggest. Honestly, that run at the end of that might be the biggest run I've ever had. Dude just is spinning his way to greatness. That sounds like a documentary, but it should be a documentary. The game, I think. Guys, I think they're gonna be moving. Often in life, things just things just. I played this guy last night, late, and this guy absolutely. I I didn't sleep. Well, no, I did sleep, but like this guy smacked me in the face. Like, this is one of my worst losses to date. Like it was it was horrible. Um, and I don't even know what to think of it. I don't know what to think of it. All I know is I better figure some things out here. That, that's all I know, is I better be better. And I think when I played them, like now when I actually like, you have, when you have time to reflect on stuff, I feel like you can get smarter. I don't like losing to anyone twice. Um, this guy, when he beat me so badly, keep in mind, we're in the NFC chip. What, how are we in the NFC chip? Well, you see my demeanor? I'm not like I was last time. Last year at this time, and you can let me know if you notice it, I was trying to spin with Jaden Daniels. I was trying to play hero ball. Now, boom, this is my last two games. 111 yards, 72 yards. He's getting the ball 16 and 15 times a game. That's how you win in the playoffs. You run the rock. This is gonna be a sweat. I don't expect this to be easy. This guy's got a really good team. He knows what he's doing and I'm gonna, I plan on it being rough. So lock in, let's be great, NFC chip, let's go. Okay, I figured out the spin. Can, right now, nobody can stop my spin move. Nobody. And I feel like a little lame because I'm like, you guys are here for Jaden Daniels. But it's like, can we just appreciate the fact that Brian Robinson Jr. is doing this? 
like this is unreal. You can also see one, two, three, four superstars, five superstars on this Packers defense. Yeah, that's that spins nasty. Second and inches. I'm just gonna keep on running. He's got five superstars on defense, and he smacked me the first time he played. You think I'm gonna go out here and give him the satisfaction of passing? Oh, you're gonna sack me again with Gary. Oh, I'm Brett. I'm just gonna sit. Blah blah. No, I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna defend myself. This is my new scheme against this guy. Boom, run, run, run. Learn to stop the run. People want to run dollar, but everybody wants to run dollar. Everyone wants to run SS Blitz 3 and all this nonsense. Everyone wants to run dollar, but nobody knows how to actually stop the run. So, it's kind of what I'm noticing right now. Yep. Go back to it. Just go back to it. Yo, if that's not the softest dude doing it oh bang that is sonata okay with me man no that's just that's sonat i can't accept that this d line is what messed me up last time so now that i'm in a passing situation i'm a little terrified but i'm just gonna throw one step reads like that's all you're gonna see snap throw snap throw snap throw snap throw nice find there to continue the series from the 18 on second down. Good, run. Good read. Oh, no, he's out. Robinson. And they take it. A handoff for Robinson running right. There you go. Seven more. It's a much slicker first little bit there. I, I like that a lot. Love from the gun. Oh my gosh. Good play, sir. That's just too much time, but it's hard to blitz his five wide. Like, when I tried blitzing it last time, I remember I was, I was moderately in a bit of shambles when I tried to blitz him a lot. Oh my gosh. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, it's the same stuff the first time I played him, where I am just a dead man walking against this five wide scheme that he's in. Just seemingly no answer, not enough pressure. It's, it's working. Whatever he's doing is working. On first and ten, here's Love. Shotgun. Throw left side complete. Too short. Let's throw him Throwing his love on third. Can't blitz it. Just Please accept right. You can't blitz it. From the red zone now. Four step to his right. I'm like, look at this dude. Like I I got nothing to respect. I can't. I don't feel like I have a defense that I can blitz, and I don't feel like I have a defense that can blitz coverage, and that's why you're seeing the result that you're seeing. He's, he's cooking. He's absolutely cooking. Now Daniels off the play action. Rolling left, buying some time. Second Send out Brian here. Send him out. From the 32. Yikes. Okay, this is literally what happened the first time I played it. As soon as I have to throw the ball, it's the shed. It's the shed of death. What would you guys want? Honestly, there's going to be people watching right now. I'm punting for you. I feel like people would want me to punt. I'm going to punt. I go for it too much. I see your guys' comments. I'm going to finally learn from you. I'm going to play the style that you guys want because you're smarter than me. I'm going to punt the ball away, and I'm going to play defense. Rather than just giving him a free seven. At least here he's got the... You know what? You guys are right. I hate that I had to do that, but... I just can't get enough time against this dude. His pass rush is relentless. Shotgun now for love. Got a man from the 
29. Escapes out to the left. Nope. nope. Here's Long. Now pressure's on him. Pressure's on him. He's punting on fourth and one. Wow. Fourth and one is crazy to punt. Like, I thought mine was crazy. I thought my decision was insane. But he's actually, he realizes this too. This is a classy game of Madden you guys are witnessing right now. Butler, man, just did. And I, I'm not overly confident that I can score seven seconds. So him punting, he avoids giving me free points. I don't want to give him free points. No one's giving out free points today. Whoever's going to the Super Bowl is about to earn this. He's back to throw. On the move, headed right. Big game downfield. So that's the halfway point of this edition of the NFL on EA Sports. And that return might just be the spark that leads to that momentous final. Can't play. Who? He's got something. Gesicki is on something or has some ability I've never heard of because that dude is breaking every single tackle. Every single tackle. I love that first half. We both punted the football. This is how playoff football should be. And I could have lost the game there. Like this, this, You guys are right. The punt was the right move. Because I'm still in this despite a really bad drive. I thought there was a chance we might make a play on that. I'm sure, but I thought there was hope. It's the hope at times that kills you, but I did think that there was hope. Like, that's insane. That's insane. I don't know, man. That is... This guy is surgical right now. This guy is playing at a higher level than me, and I can't even hate. When someone's playing at a higher level than you, you can hate or you can just be great. Shout out to you. You're playing really high level. Oh, he missed him. Still sticking with the passing game. Good defense. Good guys. Throw on third down. Closing the heavy traffic and it's intercepted. Jeremy Chen has got it. Come. Took a few games. Got him. Oh, okay, this game just changed. This game all just changed in one bad throw. Don't get me wrong, they deserve a ton of credit right Shotgun snap to Daniels. Escapes the pocket. Watching deep down the right sideline. No, what? He's still holding the ball, though. Daniels, that was a beauty, kid. That was a beautiful ball. I'm back. That was a beautiful ball. Oh, my gosh. That, is, that blitz is crazy. Oh, my gosh. I thought I just had the throw of the game to play before. I really did. And he was looking for an escape that wasn't I there. really so thought I had to play the game, and then I just not lighten up, but I I, I let up. Don't move out of the pocket quick play. enough. Okay, three punts in this game already. Trying to shake off the interception, he's looking to throw. He throws a bullet to the center field. No, that was great play by Butler. A second down throw here for Love. Left side into the hands of Dom. This is the play of the year. We had it for a moment, but a great defense. We got a decision to make. We got a decision. Oh my god. Looking to throw. There's no way. I even tried to fake him out with McCullough. I went down to the line with McCullough. The other guy ran in. Oh, gosh. He's really hit me with a five wide on this one. That's, 
put him in a hard flat. I put him in a hard flat. Believe it or not, I put him in a hard flat. Not saying there's a chance. I'm just saying. We might just have a chance. Excellent defense. Okay, 14-7. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. No, honestly, what the heck is going on? What did I adjust there? I put, I crossmanned him. I 100% thought I did. Oh, I must, oh my gosh. I thought I crossmanned him. Slab the single easiest touchdown of all time. I thought I crossmanned him. I was playing the same defense I played that last play. With a lot of zones, a couple hard flats. And when it goes bad like that, you miss an adjustment. Mm, okay, 14 all. Shotgun snap, a gift to Robinson. Good job, Robinson. I, I know I only need to. I made a massive mistake. But that mistake is no longer a big mistake if I get three points. So, that's the way I'm looking at this. It's not that big of a deal if I get three. If I don't get three, it's a really big deal, but. I just know I can't pass against this guy. He's got the best defense I've played, so. He's has the cross screen should work. It's, it's one of my signature moves. It's one of my signature moves. I just don't trust myself against this, that blitz that he runs. You guys have seen it. It comes right through the middle. It's like a, it's very slick. Like it's, it's like a 1-1000. One, one He's hitting you already type blitz. Now to throw. He's on the move. So they're gonna go ahead and call hey, the ice kick for the win. Hunt all day. If he's not calling timeouts, he's got those. He, he's guys. We got 51 yards iced to go to the Super Bowl. There we go. He uses this timeout. But I wasn't going to use my timeouts. If I use one timeout, he'd get two. He could get the ball back at that time. I, you got to play the game from here. It's a brutal kick. You got it. 100% got it. Come on, man. That feels so good. My, I had to lock in for that one. I made the best adjustment I made is I took my corner. If you would have ran a streak on that play. Yeah, not a touchdown. I took my corner and I put him in a zero yard hard flat. I had no offensive yards. I can't. It was horrible. This was the play right here. I put him, you see how he's in a hard flat? So this is, I usually play cover four. I put both those outside guys in zero yard hard flats. He tries to throw that to Gesicki quick and Emmanuel Forbes, 30 under 30, makes by far the pick of the season. Jumping in front of that. That is just... And, like, honestly, I knew I couldn't... I, you saw it earlier. This is what I... Hey, I got to give myself a pat on the back. You guys saw me play this guy. You saw I didn't move the entire first game. You can be stubborn, and you can say, I know I can pass against him. Or you can just accept what you can't control. I accepted that I can't pass against him. I accepted that he's better than me on defense to offense. And what did I do? I just found a way to win. Beautiful. Jaden Daniels, GG's. Ladies and gentlemen, bruh, this is like the revenge tour of people who punched, like, who killed me in this game. Guys, I gotta show you the devs. There's a couple really good ones. We lost one. We lost a lot of good men. Uh, this is, this is on me. I would like to take full responsibility for this. And I, I'm not necessarily proud of it. It just wasn't working out. And I, I can honestly say I love Terry McLaurin, but I do better with Luke and Isaiah Bond is now a superstar. So Isaiah went up to a superstar depth. So he's a 90 overall. Isaiah Bond is my new Terry McLaurin. You need number one receiver. Bond is my new number one receiver. And I love Terry. Shout out to him. And I got one other superstar dev up that I'm super pumped up uh, to show you guys here. I'm probably going to go evasive matchup nightmare and maybe shorten so he runs really good routes. Um, this is long overdue. Eight interceptions, led the entire NFL in interceptions. Benjamin St. 
just awesome kids. The 27 year old Canadian, first Canadian ever to be a superstar in Madden. That might be true. Who would, I don't know if there's another one. Um, Jeremy Chen, obviously. But we're about to play a roster. We're about to play a team that's legit and a real rebuild. We got essentially, let me show you real quick 94 overall, X Factor Bo Nix, Superstar Cortland, Superstar Hollywood, Adam Trotman. A good D-line, Mason Graham, and then Adebo, Patrick Sertan, Brandon Jones. This is a great Broncos rebuild. And I have no hate in my heart for this Broncos rebuild. It's a good Commanders rebuild versus a great Broncos rebuild. And it's going to be the best man win. This guy absolutely killed me the first time. I didn't score a point. So it's like, hey, I got a chance at a little bit of redemption against the guy that I didn't even score a point against. And hopefully that redemption is sweet. And we figure it out, we move the ball, and we leave here with the Jaden Daniels ring. If not, it is what it is, we bounce back. It's been a fun season no matter what. Plus one awareness, plus one spin move for Isaiah Bond. Let's see what else we got here. Dasan McCullough, Emmanuel Forbes. Okay, I'm ready. Let's go. Ready okay, ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna, ago. I'm gonna spin. There's no other way to describe my offensive game plan than I'm about to spin to win, baby. And that's a hey, two runs. Jaden likes what he's seeing. I'm saying Brian Robinson. Fly away. Let's fly away. Maybe. I'll have to pay you, too, because he, he needs some money. So... On first and ten, it's Robinson. He gets away from Robinson one. breaks the tackle. He's just breaking. If you try and arm tackle him, he's going to break that tackle. Sort of right? the this is another guy. Game number one that I played him, I didn't move. I like where you're so, Obviously, we've been I didn't score a single point. You know me. Of course. Take that shot early of course, I'm going to come out and run the ball. I didn't score against, bro. So it's like, you can be stubborn, out. or you can they be like, hey, two I didn't score since 20 against you. I'm going to run. Quarter. That's how I'm feeling right now. I didn't score against you. I'm going to run. They'll run again here with Robinson. Yep, good run. They'll, first get... They'll run this one right with Robinson. Ball forward, Robinson. Second out of four. Give left side to Robinson. Yep, got him again. Get first out. Out of the Stop here. the run, buddy. Now, Stop the run, please. As got the well, actually, please don't, because I don't, I'm not very. Junior, let's go, dude. This is gross, and this is this is gross, and this is lame. But it's it's kind of. Oh no! I don't know. Oh, no, I don't know. Not I something that you see years. very often from a quarterback of his caliber, an opening drive a double tap day. Oh, there's no doubt I in my mind that even he's surprised at how day. that one played out. I haven't done that. But we know this guy is not going to stop him from continuing oh, to fire. Oh, that is one of the most defeating feelings in all of that. Across the field for that one. And let him know After a good drive, see, I was trying to throw him off and just to the flatter. Here's Nix. Eluding the pressure right. That's caught. It's Marvin Mims. Throwing Knicks. Man open. He's got it complete yeah. to Cortland Sutton. He's got room to roam. <laughs> you can't double tap A, bro. Dang it, man. Touchdown. You cannot double tap A. Okay, we got a game, folks. Buckle up. Sit up in your seats. Grab your popcorn, grab your snacks. Let's go. They had the football wound up leading to a touchdown the other way. How do you approach drive number two? Going back to your okay, game now plan throw. coming in. Which is good. I shouldn't be allowed to like come others. out in a Super Bowl no, and play that an that late. Like, definitely players. should be confident for spots that. And get your Brian is breaking. And this is going to be a commander's first like, He is. No matter what happens here, Brian Robinson is playing out of his mind completely. Throwing now is Daniels. He'll take a shot for the end zone. My name is James. And it will be intercepted. Picked off by Pat Sertan. And the oh, you know what? Ready to go. 
Now I gotta, I got myself into this. Now I gotta respectfully, I gotta get myself out of it. On their last time out, look at repeat that in Charles' defense. They were very frustrated after giving there. up six the last time on the field. It's just Pat, that, that's Patrick Sertan. It's just a battle of wills in a lot of ways because you know they're both motivated. They threw it right at the moment that I drive. thought I could throw it. They both have specific outcomes in mind. did not pan out. To me, it just whatsoever. comes down to who can execute better and which side can step up and assert its will over the other. He'll find his tight end attack. Nicks to the air. Thanks, buddy. Thanks, buddy. Hey, I'm not done yet. I got life. I got a little bit of and boy, oh boy, Jeremy Chin. You might never truly get it how badly we needed that. So I threw two in a row, one by a mistake. We're back. Relax. They start on the ground with Robinson here. Well, that rumble, 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 rumble. Yep. To the air yep. goes Daniels. Get it to Isaiah. That play's got a lot of swagger to it. If you guys want to knock on the swagger, this play right here, this, the movement that you get out of this, and like you can just get the ball to your athletes. Like I really, really, really like it, and I, I love the movement in it. Off the play fake, Daniels. Now he's forced out left. And a loose football. But fortunately, he's able to Where recover you? his own fumble. Or that could Where have been were you Jaden caught the ball from himself? There. 12 yards, first down. I almost just had for three him, that ball stayed close and he could recover it on his own. And that speaks to the greatness of Daniels. He just caught the ball. He just caught his own ball. When he found the football again, able to retain possession. Rolling to his right. Go. Slide. And he slid. Now those plays, those two that you just mentioned. Now Robinson coughs up the football. It's loose. No, I can go with that. Truly, I don't believe really what you talked it. about there. That's if they take care of the football, number one, That's maybe they're not having this deficit. And I don't know two, how he plans to play this if he's taking this to the half or not. And he's I, not going to go know. anywhere as they get him down. He gets ball at half. Yeah, scrimmage. he's just taking this to half. Okay. Fair enough, buddy. He's not taking any risks. Oh my gosh, Time what a, it like, Ryan Robinson Jr., down, what a season, two still like, remain. We he was step unbelievable aside. all this year, is the NFL. and just the least, Sports. oh gosh, a fumble in that spot when I have a legitimate chance to kind of stay in it is just gut-wrenching. Half of football, and they can do exactly that. Oh gosh, just like tore my Achilles tendon trying to hit stick this bounds. guy. It was a bizarre, bizarre, stupid hit stick. This will be caught by Brown. And get it. Now we give up the middle to Williams. And a little bit better. And maybe they're starting to make some headway. And now. They'll stay on the ground with Williams. And he'll be taken down at the Third 33, down. a pickup. It's of almost four. as if he's just saying. In the first half, he was held Brett in check made three on the ground, mistakes. despite that lack of production. Two that I would say were accidents. I'm just going to take advantage that. of it. They could actually charge him, too. Yeah, he's one running in this situation. Yeah, I respect that. He's and literally saying, this could go so down as the worst Super Bowl of all time. This actually could very well go down as the worst Super Bowl in NFL history. Can we get a fumble though? Like he's he's getting these fumbles and it's cool. And I'm very proud of him. But like, if I hit stick Hollywood, can I get a fumble six? Because at the end of the day, if he throws the ball and he throws his finger now, I can be right back in this game. It's not over for me. That's why I'm playing my man-on-man -man aggressive defense. But it looks to me as if he is going to play this the right way. And he's just the running. Middle, it's Williams. He's he honestly, I'm not talking about. He's just saying, 14. I'm gonna run the ball. I'm gonna take my gonna ten point lead. First of their three timeouts. And I'm gonna try and win off the ten point lead. We'll be back Brett threw it this. twice. Brett messed up twice. From the gun, it's a run for Williams. Seriously, this is fourth and one. 
Oh, this is the worst Super Bowl of all time. I don't even know what to say. I'm speechless at how bad this Super Bowl is. Okay, we got hope. It's some like there's not a lot of it, but I do have a little bit of hope. Hail Mary shot. Onside kick. Things can happen for sure. Yeah, they need them badly. Trailing here. You know what? No, no superstar Terry. No superstar Terry. Still alive, but we're barely. I was looking, and I'm like, he over adjusted there. You don't need a superstar to make that catch. I think he was more focused on Bond on the street. What a dot from Jaden Daniels. Okay, onside kick, 100%. This, this is because worst case, he's got a half field. Like, this is onside kick chance. And That's the Broncos are going to get the football. Oh, like the risk reward of the onside kick. When you don't get it, the risk comes out to play. I got one time up because I had to burn position. two when he and was killing me before. But it looks like you're trying he's your sweating for the Super Bowl. To press when you <coughs> I think he's running this. And field position yeah. leads That's why I rank him in the first play. Call. He's definitely running it. Again, it's Williams. It'll be taken down at the 40. Now it's Knicks. Escaping the pressure right. Go out of bounds. I man up the RPO. No, I'll show you guys my adjustment. I did. I man him up. Before he's taken down I man him up. The 29. I think that's game, but I man up. Separating these two sides with bubble. two minutes left I, to go in the fourth. I swear I man that thing up. Yeah, but it's oh, looking good as they come on first and ten. Good game, dude. They'll run out of the gun here, Williams. And I Bynum's going to get his shot. You know what? The end of the day, I can't blame him myself. I'm the one who double tapped it. In a hurry as a safety and run support. I'm the one who clicked the button. That was good me. Nobody too. else made those mistakes. I'll own my mistakes. And this guy just played small ball. As soon as he got the lead, as soon as I messed up He's like that, he just played small ball the remainder of the way. The ball. And part of the game is just taking clock. advantage of your opponent's mess up. He took advantage and I, I gave him a lot of He just won the Super Bowl with the Broncos. Credit where it's due, man. I swear I manned that up, but I, I, got, I really want to watch that back because I am convinced now a Here's that I manned it up. And he went nowhere. Well, he went backwards. Back to Good the game, boy. Shout out to him for not taking these. I think he's playing it pretty cool, but there's definitely a chance I manned up the wrong guy. Yo, good GGs. I would be so pumped if I won the Broncos. He did everything he had to do. I just messed up. Freaking A. And the fumble, the Brian Robinson Jr. fumble. I think you look back. He's going to haunt us a little bit. This is, tears, the off we'll get one. The this is a much better season. Camp. I, I one, want two, that to three. be known. All building up this is significantly Super better. Um, it's worth it. It certainly is, and rarely I think Daniels do we have a team that hoists the Lombardi Trophy. We got a really good receiver. Like, we, we're a better the team than we were didn't when have we to came face into this. In the journey. It's and just now, unfortunate that I lost on a play that I was waiting for. The play that I was literally like, oh, he's about Super to run. Champion underneath it. Commissioner Goodell going to make the presentation of the like, Lombardi oh, Trophy to, to the Denver Broncos. They We're are Super Bowl your right Super Bowl 60 champions. Who is he? Who is he manned up on? I swear I manned this guy up on this so dude. Conclude like I, I manually manned him up. Maybe I messed up who so it was. I want to see the game tape. Because you see where he plays it? On our crew, I'm He's Gordon clearly not man up to anybody. Oh, maybe I, I must have manned him up to the running back by accident. By the looks of that, it tells me that I think I manned him up to the running back. And I left the most obvious read in the book. An RPO read bubble for the bowl. The game, though, if you really look at it, like it was the shortest game of all time. The game sucked. It sucked. The game sucked. Look at him. He's just running the ball out. Game sucked. Wallace this was it too right here boom sometimes the luck's with you sometimes it's against you boom gets rid of the ball yo shout out to my opponent we got a lot to talk about we got a lot to talk about we got a lot to talk about oh my gosh we'll talk and resign here in a minute okay guys going into next year i need you i need the comments i'm i'm rich i'm so rich
so rich. I got 140 million. I think it's about time we stop being scared. Brian Robinson Jr. loses his dev after Super Bowl week. Oh my gosh, this just can't get any. Just kick a man while he's down. So Terry lost his dev. Robinson Jr. lost his. I'm going to accept his option. My question for the comment section is who do I re-sign? Now that Brian Robinson Jr. lost his dev and you fumbled, you know what? Maybe he sees free agency. Maybe we go into free agency with 140 million. Maybe I let all these guys walk. And I go into free agency and I go all in. You guys have never seen me go all in. You don't want to see it because it's terrifying. You're going to be scared. I don't want you to freak out. You're going to have to, it's going to be scary. Maybe I go into free agency with 134 million. I let all these old dudes walk and we move on. We pay a bunch of people a bag and we bring in some new faces. Comment down below. Are you cool with that? I'm sorry I lost the bowl. The double tap A was one of the biggest sells of my life. I will be better for this. I will be better. These two we can build around. We're still a solid team and I love you guys. Peace.